Settings, advanced window resolution. That is that already having on. Is the second number? If I do by ten twenty four. Yeah, there we go. Except it's not below my current the task bar now. Okay, now it's not like the top upper left of my monitor. That's the word. Transfer party. Now are my beeples here? Yes! Yes! People! Glorious dwarf party! Rocket stone! And, and, and debut, which is our halfling friend for some reason. Oh, except bib dib but was the dwarf. Shit. Alternatively, two fighters. Oh, she's a fighter too. We didn't have a wizard. I got me. I'm a cleric. What's the normal starting level for this game? Weren't they like level three? Are we gonna be woefully overgeared? That's fine. Oh. Problem. The auto map is halfway off the screen. Yes! Look at our boys that I just remembered because I only reloaded the first thing on the first game to check if the save file was there. Plus five longsword. Jesus Christ. I actually want to see something real quick. Uh, <laughs> what level are we supposed to be? Oh, except this deletes my entire game. God damn it. Stop and claim not exit the game. I want a main menu. Bong. <gasps> Gasp. Okay, if I start a new game with a new party. Ooh. This is fancy. Oh, I love his lack of teeth. <laughs> Man, your uh, stats suck ass. I love him. Sir, suck ass. Okay, no, just fuck it. Oh god, I clicked elf. Gross. Ew. He also sucks ass. Suck ass but pointy. Human. Cleric. Neutral. Great party we got coming together. Alright. Entering game. How? What level are these guys? I don't know. All I see is HP and food. Oh, no, he's level seven. Okay, so we're not... Yeah, this does pick up. I thought the import party was like three before I imported my actual Beeple peoples. Guess what? I get to be sad again because we're going to go to quick game and it's going to go... Nope, that's not to the main menu. That's uh, off entirely. I hate it. Gross. Okay, I swear we're going to be doing something here in a bit. Donk. Get out. Don't load in progress. Give me these dudes, all my glorious boyfriends. Yeah, because they're probably who has my, my stuff. We could take... But... We'll be fine. Okay, so the only problem is, like, the, the further third of my auto map is off my other monitor screen. Oh, and this is far too large. One sec. Yeah. Yeah. Question, though. How do I capture the auto map? Can I? Yes. Oh, only that much is off my screen. Weird that it doesn't capture what's actually physically off my monitor. Right mouse button to toggle title bar. I have no idea what that is. But I can capture the all-seeing eye. I just need to duplicate this. How do I do that again? Copy. <gasps> dog! He's coming to give us kisses! Aw. Poor doggy. Taste. There's birds. Duplicate. There we go. The sun is shining. The birds are singing. My dick is throbbing. What a beautiful day for cooming. I forgot I said that. Don't, 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 don't listen to anything I said. <laughs> there you go. Tiny little auto map. And then we have as much as I can see, which is some of it off screen. Hopefully that is not a problem. Does it come back on screen if I move the window? Yes. Oh no, the darkness is going to eat it. Oh, it doesn't do that on OBS anymore. Boo. Boo. 
Okay. Uh, there's also a black bar above it. Does that literally just exist to hide the title bar? It does say when I try to capture it on OBS, right mouse button to toggle title bar. It literally just hides the the top bar of my window. I guess. I don't care that much. Mm-hmm. Uh. Well, I'm making sure that this is properly aligned. Transform. Fit to a screen. Uh huh. Good, good. Scooch them. Yes, yes. Warp stone. Yes, yes. We're going to be missing part of the auto map. I'm sure it's not going to be a problem. I don't know what to put in the lower right other than the rat bottle. Do I have anything to put down there? Oh, I could put the cool art that I found. That's art for the next game and not this one. Boom. Yeah. Yeah. That looks fucking rad. Look at those spooky, scary skeletons. Awesome. A Dungeon and Dragons. Hold on. Can I get the logo? Uh, Eye of the Beholder 2 logo PNG. Oh, it exists. Oh my god, it actually like properly is. And it's going to be a web page file. It's not! Here we go. Perfect stream. Copyright. Advanced done in Nangin. Eye of the boo. Get scared, scared. Yes! Yes! Eh, that's overlapping like hell. <laughs> Hold on. I didn't realize I was doing that. Here we go. Put the skeletons in the corner. Oh look, they appeared. This isn't even the right game. It's just the cooler art. Like, I can get the art for uh, Eye of the Beholder 2. I put Eye of the Holder. Eye of the Beholder 2, cover, art. Yes. Yes. I mean, this one's pretty cool. That's a penis. But this one's pretty cool. I'm pretty sure this is our main man, Kelvin, uh, doing necromantic things. With a name like Blackstaff, surely he's not evil. This one's a lot larger. Eh. And I make my own cover art with Kelvin and Blackstaff. At this point, I just need to make a... And these little bird chirpies in the bathroom. I wish there was music. There isn't. The sound is on. Skelemons. There we go. Oh, and the rat bottle's back. Where is that? Rat spinning dot gif. Excellent. Bottle dot png. Scooch. Oh, there's like a footstep in the distance. There we go, and then we see the cool Skelemans, and, and Kelvin got Mike Wazowski. Is this centered? I don't think so. Do I care? Yeah, kind of. <gasps> it's perfect. Well, I'm being autistic. I mean, art artistic. There. Now it looks like he's touching. It's like holding up da na 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 video game. Ah, oh, there. Amazing. I love it. This didn't need to take an hour. Fuck it. If I'm not procrastinating, I'm not living. Hey! Okay. When we last left off, we killed a beholder or something. Can I detach? Hold on. I can hide this entirely. Is it possible to detach this from the window? Because it's just another 
It's literally just another window, but it's like adhered to the side of. Ooh. Oh. <gasps> Spooky darkness. You can't see me moving the window, but it's adhered to the side of the window. I kind of wish I could put it on my other monitor. Oh, well, we're missing like 10, 15%-ish. It's fine. Right! I don't remember what happened in the first game. There was a beholder. He had eyes. He was fucking about. I assume that's about the gist of it. 10 out of 10. Thumbs up. Video game. I need to ch 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 change the controls. How do I do this again? Uh, I think I unbind these. Delete. 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 <gasps> delete. 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 W E S A D. That spells sad. Here we go. Now I have mouse movement. Or er, was movement. You can't go that way. <gasps> a dog! Pet it! Aw, oh, what a good boy. Do I have, like, option options? Meme options. I think it's preferences, right? <gasps> Sounds are on bar graphs. Ew, text, grow, man. Dorm and Tagar have crazy health. I don't. What are my garbage health rolls? Also, why do I have my, my fucking grabbers out? Should I not have a sword Or a spear? Was spears considered unbalanced? Hi, puppy. Oh, look at the baby. I don't know how to get back to my shit. Help. Pay him. I might have had a spear right there. <laughs> Look at him going bright. I love him so much. Look at that potato dog. I kind of want to... I wish there was a toggle, like uh, the, 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 the Curse of Monkey Island and Treasure of Monkey Island and Return to Monkey Island remakes have um, a like active toggle where you press like a bumper key the button there for console. Gross. Uh, and it will switch between the retro graphics and the new graphics. I kind of wish there was just a toggle for the potato AI upscaler thingy. Turn to sound up. We'll put it on 69. Nice. Then we can hear the birds and the dog's going Wrap. <gasps> like now. There he is. He's going Wrap. I love him. <gasps> dog! I love that this game starts with puppies. So apparently I can, like, touch the auto map. I have to properly tab out. This is due. Add note, peak level. Ah! No! Cheating! Wait, no. Unpeak. Unpeak. There we go. <laughs> Add note, peak level, show map elements button. Ooh, you can see illusory walls monsters? No, no, not peak. Stop. I didn't mean to do that. Except for if you're lost. That's cute. This is a whole combat HUD do Wait. Combat HUD docking. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> I could detach it. Level one, the fourth. There we go. And now I can see the rest of the map, and you can't. Because fuck you. Any map. Also means I get to realign this yet again. Hold up. Oh, that just locks them. Can I select both of these? <gasps> I can, and then move them together. Wow! Thanks, Kelvin. If only your name was Kevin, because, like, Kevin's a cool name. Evan was my friend from the forest. He was a good man. Aggressively petting dogs until we, they take a nap. Yeah, we're not harming them. That's uh, that's 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 elf propaganda. We are petting them and then taking them home with us. What else can I do with this? Combat HUD docking. So is the top thing a combat HUD? Yes, and now it's off screen. Hang on. Hold on. There's more shit we can do. 
I just have to take this and scoop it down a bit. Now detach it. Yeah, it's just a normal black bar. I, I, I guess. What's it do? It says combat HUD. So if I go, go, go get myself nibbled by the doggies. Dave. Th that's definitely cool. Yeah, my uh, QWE ASD keys don't work for typing. They are WASD controls. Thankfully, DOSBox lets you. <gasps> Holy shit! It shows the wolf! <laughs> I need to capture this! Hold on! They're gonna eat me alive! Good thing my party has high AC in the front. Uh, 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 how do I paste? Copy. Duplicate. Duplicate. I don't think I'm gonna use this. But, like, just to see. Yeah, look at it! You can see the dog HPs. And we can pet them aggressively. See, look at the good boys all getting petted. Dong. These are cute dogs. Oh, it's like animated and everything too. Wow. What a good dog. Oh god, we have to pick up arrows, don't we? Ew. Ew. It's fine. There's dogs. It's cool. I wish there was music. Is there not going to be music in this game? Do I need to play my own? I don't think I'm going to use the combat HUD. Although, I could put the combat HUD, like, down here for you guys. <gasps> I don't know if it's going to be exactly visible, being this small. But, you guys can, like, as the GM, sneak a peek into... Fucking, you know, sit there, asshole. Yeah, sneak peek. Oh, move him back down. No. Oh, no. Wait. I see stars. The setup is necessary, yes. Professional stream. 10 out of 10. Amazing. And now, if I go find dogs... A rock! Nice. Yeah, that's cool that the Steam version has the auto map and everything. You guys can see the dog! I don't... Is that at all visible? Is it visible? It's barely visible in full screen. It'll be fine! It's a feature! People are gonna come in and go, what the fuck is that? It's a feature! I actually wonder, um, if I, I'm probably putting far too much effort into this, if I take this, and I green screen out the black, color, you know, chroma key, chroma key, perfect, doggy, we can use you, we can see stuff. Chroma key. And we do the darkness. Not the green. Whoops. Uh. Well, uh, you can see the health bar. That is the thing. Alright, so that's clearly not working. Weird that when I chroma key out black, like pure black, it also takes the gray and the the white on the gray with it. Why is it doing that? Yeah. I have like smoothness and similarity set to zero. Why that's not smooth? That's not similar. That's lame and dumb and stinky poo poo. I guess it only actually does colors, not like light level. Yeah, fucking. I guess if it's a white, it still chroma keys out the black. Eh, stuff is dumb. 
No one will be able to see this. <laughs> you know what? I, I, I'm not going to bother. Uh, delete, delete, delete. Remove. Put Kelvin back up there. Wasting all the time. This dog can't hit us, like, period. He is such a good boy. I love him so much, though. He's doing his best. As I make sure that Kelvin is slightly too far to the like a pixel. There. Wonderful. Okay. <laughs> okay. Fancy this achieved. Pat the dog. Look, doggy, here's a cool sword. If you if you if I throw it, you can bring it back like it's a stick. What a good boy! Oh, there's another one. I love him. That wolf has a lot of HP though. Are these dire wolves. Oh my god, there's another one. There's so many puppies in this forest. Rawr. Okay, what do I even have? A shitload of healing and rations. Oh right, we have food. And I'm sitting here fucking around. What does this button do? Is that where I drag stuff to go? Oh, ring of sustenance. Nice. Ring of feather fall. Feather fall and protection. Jack shit. Several scrolls. Ah, yes. A scroll of cause light. Wow knows. Ring of adornment. And ring of adornment. I think that's charisma, right? Is there any way to, like, see what these do? Quick, look at it. Sniff it. Touch it. Poke it. Dan dent. Late mail. Necklace of adornment. I have a lot of things of adornment, apparently. Leather boots that are very blue. Holy symbol of Moradin, Moradinsman. Potion healing, ration. Yeah, you're basically just a ration carrier, huh? Ah, big rations. They're even, like, thicker, too. What's this? Oh, Kelvin's coin! Gimme. Aww. Oh, there we go. That was gloves. Yeah, I have a shield. And my clerical symbol. And nothing else. What is this? Longsword. Plus four longsword. Plus five longsword. Racers of protection. Plus two. These dogs are really trying their best. Plus three bandit armor. And a basic helmet. Basic shield. Leather boots. Four strength, four stamp, leather belt. Oh, oh. Maybe a dormant is wisdom. Doggies. I'm trying to build craft here. Fuck off. I love you. You are adorable puppies, but gap. What are my stats? 16 charisma. If I take off the ring... Fourteen. Oh, did that stack anymore? They might not stack. That might have been changed from the first one to the second one. I don't think they're actually supposed to stack. Eh. Necklace of adornment. Now what? Fourteen, fourteen, seventeen, thirteen, fourteen, sixteen. Armor class two. The fuck does a ring of adornment do? Is it just fancy? Like, it adorns you? That's its property? But it's entirely non-magical? Because that's just, just what they do. Uh, I of the beholder. Ring of adornment. I love you, puppies! Grabbing a ring of adornment into a sink? What? This is not even the right game. I think AD and the I think what the fuck does this do? No replies. Nobody knows. Burning hands. Xanthar's outer sanctum. <laughs> Magical, but seems to have no effect on statistic. Holy shit, I think I just heard, saw, heard someone get hurt. <gasps> they hit my guy! They rolled a 20! Kill. Kill. 
Kill. Kill. This is a thick wolf. Are you a dire no. wolf? Wow! He's like the boss wolf. He's definitely not. Kill. Wait. Adornment. What the fuck does a ring of adornment do? No effect on statistics. Wearing a ring of adornment. Ring of Adornment, QBAG, QBNALGUVATNAQJREREG, ZNTVPNYVAGUR. I don't! This guy just started speaking in tongues. What happened to him? The unresponsive to this is an emulator. Issue the titular beholder J V Y Y O R S B H A Q N G. This guy got consumed by the Matrix back in 2018 or something. What the fuck is happening? There are several people speaking in tongues. What's going on? Is this supposed to be magic? Oh god! Pretty funny to think about it. Seems like a magic item, but on reflection, its name just bluntly says, "It does what any ring does." They 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 literally aren't. It, it literally does nothing. It's a joke item. Cool. Got it. J a b v d d d b d b d q e r e s. Oh, tower. Yeah, but there could be stuff in the woods, like rocks and this knife. Good dog. I want to go to this next zone, actually. Do you wish to enter Dark Moon? Uh, no, thank you. I'm good. Uh, however, uh, I'm pretty sure there's not going to be any music. I'm pretty sure the, the first game had no music either. So... Music. RuneScape. It's like 10 years late, but RuneScape music will do just fine. Yeah, I think I was supposed to have a spear on me... But it did say it removes items that were unbalanced or obsolete or had no function, so probably like quest items. Rare. Good dog. Some of these wolves have like 40 fucking HP. Hold on. Music! Oh. Perfect. I don't want the rusty dagger, but maybe we need a rusty dagger. There's going to be a, like a, a secret later on that's like, what is the eating of the metal? I'm like, oh, it's rust. It's rust. You do rust. Hello, puppies. I love them. Ow, they actually hit me. But good boys and possibly good girls. Yeah, some of these wolves have 25 HP according to the combat tracker. Which I am now going to hide. Yay. And some of them have like 40. They have random HP. That makes sense. That's a D&D &D thing. Wow. Oh, look. A grave. You wish to dig at this grave. No. I have the feeling that since you are given the option to dig up graves. That there's going to be an alignment system or something. We shall respect it. Poor souls, I'm sure they have found no peace now. I am a cleric. Should probably not disturb the dead. <laughs> I should probably prepare any spells. Abort. Pray for spells. Uh, What do I got up to? We can get up to 6th level. Yeah, neutralize poison is probably good. Party wide protect from evil. Prayer is good. Uh, dispel magic, maybe. I don't think magic vestment is going to be any good at all. Probably remove paralysis just to be safe. Aid probably is party wide. 
just because of limitations in the game, but also eight is not party wide in the normal game. Just in case. Bless, however, is AoE. You know, not cough, cure. Yeah, stop, no, clear, fuck. Anyways, two blesses, one for the each of us. Several aids, oops. Oh, protection from evil's good, though. But also cure light wounds. I'm gonna assume everything is just AoE. I don't think there's any way, if I recall correctly, to... Select which dude you want to use shit on. Flame Blade is probably... You don't stop that. Just the weapon I'm holding. Eh, we'll be fine. We got potions for days. We can rest. I can simply conjure food. If I need to. That's saved. Need to rest to gain spells again. I'm gonna go find myself a suitable corner right here. And give me my spells. Asked healing. I mean, I don't have my healing anymore. <gasps> oh no. It. Do higher level spells take longer to prepare in AD&D? Yeah, yeah. Or does this have the 3rd edition and Pathfinder cleric thing of you can sub any spell of any level as a cleric for a healing spell so that, you know, you're not just spamming healing spells for all your slots and you can do stuff. still seems really quiet. That might also be because the game has absolutely no sounds, almost. There's like birds, me running into the wall. I think we're in a small graveyard. Eh, we are. It's sad. Let us not defile the dead. <gasps> Dog! These dogs are going to have so many bones that they can dig up and chew on. You're gonna be such happy puppies. But good boys. And good girls. Okay. Oh, it is per person! Okay. Ow, my ears! That was a lovely sound effect. Thank you, game. That one's much nicer. Oh, hi! There's a dude! An old haggard woman! If you say so, suddenly appears from the forest. Her ooh, ooh, ooh. There is music, just not in the woods. Attack. What's not? Her wrinkled mouth cracks into a smile as she gazes at the party. Pardon me, can I help you? Inquire. Where they get. Music is dinkly. We're looking for an old friend who was lost in this region. Her name is Amber. She laughs. Lost in these woos? <laughs> yeah, the D did not translate well. I find it hard to believe. Your Amber has not come this way and would have, or I would have seen her. I do, not know of a sm I do know of a small temple nearby. Perhaps the clerics of Darkwing can help you. I can take you there if you want. No thanks, I found it. May luck be with you in your travels. Goodbye! Thanks. Uh, I definitely could have gone to Darkwing without seeing you. So I assume Amber could have too. Oh look, it's Darkmoon! You know, with the newest and like greatest and crappiest new Pokemon naming conventions, long until we get a Pokemon that's just called Darkmoon. We already have Roaring Moon. Ugh. Yeah. Bushes to the south look strange. Perhaps we can investigate. <gasps> Behind the brush, you discover a hidden stairway. Do you wish to go to the stairs? Yes! Holy crap! 
catacomb level one. There's, there's just a hidden dungeon here. Oh my God, I love that. Holy crap, I love that. That's cool. Oh, it's just loot down here. Neat. Rotten food. Oh, let's not. Leather armor. Mage's scroll of blur. We should probably get a wizard at some point. Although having two fighters on a front line is also probably good. Although I could front line as well. Uh, here you go, John. Ooh, wait. Why is there more on the auto map? Like, you guys see that, right? There's... a thing. That might just be like a loading zone and then some older game trick where the center of the map is where you always load into and then it teleports you to where you're supposed to be. So there's just a random like two tile gap there. You don't see any like hidden yard. That's super cool that there's just a little hidden thing. I wonder if there's a random chance for uh, your guy to, to see it. I am a cleric, so like if, if perception is based on wisdom, I don't know if that's even a thing in 2nd edition. I got the peepers to see stuff. We also have a rogue, which will help. You're a rogue, right? And a harflin. Fourteen strength fighter. Oof. Fourteen constitution fighter. Damn, bro, you suck. Yeah, that's where I like it. Oh, that's me. Never mind. Right, I'm a cleric. That's better. That was not our fighter. Damn. Damn. Kill. Maybe his name is Urum and not Dorum. Who knows? He knows. It, it's his own fucking name. You cannot go that way. <gasps> a rock! The mightiest of loot. Or possibly a stone. So many dogs in these woods. Yeah, dealing like 12 and 17 damage compared to the pre-generated characters thing of... God, what was it? I think the auto map is a little bit wrong. What the hell's... Wait, no? Like, five is the damage that the uh, non-import character did. Hey, just another way to come over here. Wish to enter Dark Moon. Yes! Without entering Temple Darkwood, all could do. I do that metamorphosis depending on what direction I'm looking at him from. D for Dark Moon. T for turning on the music slightly. Ding. Hello, oh, dear God. Oh my God! Don't look at me like that, ma'am. I don't know what she reminds me of, but I hate it. There are two clerics standing here. As you approach, they bow slightly. The woman speaks with delight. Welcome to Dark Moon. I am Nadia. I think that's Nadia, not Naoria. D for D's nuts. I don't like her lack of nose. She's like Play-Doh Man or that weird clown I see in my dreams sometimes. This is Brother Jar. How may I be of a service? Attack! Like you just be an asshole. We have come from Waterdeep. We are looking for a friend who has been lost in these woods. Her name is Amber. Have you seen her? Jar looks quizzically at Nadia. No, we have not seen her. They're lying. They definitely look like those kind of priests that are like, Welcome to our commune and our... Not commune. Oh, what do they call it?
They always like fuck off into the woods in their little community, and it always gets weird and culty, and they're really friendly, and it's a fucking scam, and I'm scared of them! Welcome to our sanctum. No, it starts with an S, I think, though. These woods are quite calm and very peaceful here. Have you seen all the wolves? You look worn and tired. Please rest and enjoy Dark Moon. Can I, like, have not the text be AI upscaled here? Because the D's look like, oh, it's just throwing me off sometimes. Commune is right. I thought it started with, like, an S, and it was, like, a more, like, a religious form of a commune. Oh, hi. You look like a woman who would be named Amber and looking terrified and need me to get out of here. Woman garbed in full armor stands before you. Looks extremely troubling. Why are you so distressed? Can we help you? I'm looking for my sister, Kalanora. Where's that Kalandra? I can't tell anymore! She was breathing in my forest last night. And with Nadia's help, I have been searching for her. But I fear for the worst. Have you seen her? I found an old woman. Is there any traces left behind? Do you have any clues? Last night, we made camp in the forest. When I awoke this morning, she was gone. There were signs of a struggle near her at... Oh, near her bed. I... In the, I went, what the fuck is a bayo? But no traces are left to follow. Please, if you see my sister, guide her. Nadia will care, take care of her until I return. I was continue my search. The woman then turns to leave the temple. I didn't see her, like, physically in the world. I wonder if it's just random chance to run into those people. Carving of the Four Winds. Yeah, this is a big improvement on Eye of the Beholder 1. Eye of the Beholder 1 was just a dungeon romp, and I don't think it really had, like, this monstrosity stuff going on with the pop-up peoples. Except for when you, like, found your party members, maybe? So can I go into the woods and look for the lost child that I'm certain the priests have sent into the darkness? Oh, cool. That's the secret thing. Where mommy is at? It stopped because YouTube is trying to load an ad instead. So ad blockers still do work. It's just it like sometimes freezes on the ads rather than skips them. And is fucking annoying. Although sometimes it doesn't. And you get that guy going, you should buy toothpaste. Like, I don't brush my teeth. Fuck up. That's a lie I do. I forget a lot of the time, but I try to remember. If God wanted my teeth to rot out of my face, he wouldn't have invented soda. Or didn't want my teeth. I don't see... a lost child, unless... your sister is a rock... Okay, so what I'm pretty sure is going on is the uh, creepy temple priests are kidnapping children's or people. I don't actually know if they're kids. I hope not. That'd be weird. <gasps> Just step into the doorway. Nadia clears her throat rather loudly and Jarl calls from behind. You are not permitted to go in there. I will to our private chambers and only members of the cloth are allowed. Please step back, my friends. Why did we do that? This area was restricted. Why is it not locked? guys floating. I don't like that. That seems very Mind Flayer-ish. I can't talk to them again. That I know of. Maybe I do have to go find the shit in the woods. Or I can just ignore them. Barge in, because we have a hunch. And I am an adventurer. If I have a slight hunch that they are evildoers, I am legally obligated to barge into their stupid little temple and go rooting through all their crap and stealing their money. Oh, that might have been what this other area is for. Did I ever go in here? I was like, this is disconnected. <gasps> Scary! <laughs> Oh my god, there's so many wolves. That kid is so fucking dead. Boing.
Mag his ass. How do you do less damage to it from behind? He's a good and honorable warrior. I cannot abide by such treachery. I mean, it's a dog. It's like an animal. Does it have a concept of honor? Have to step on a specific square? Hmm. I don't see any half-eaten sisters over here. Just tons and tons and tons of very aggressively vicious and ravenous wolves. Oh, maybe she's in a little catacomb? I found a secret hidey hole. That's where I would hide out. I do wonder if the little accidentally revealed thing on the uh, map there's more down here. Is not like a monster sound effect or dripply tomb? <laughs> Half eaten sis, context please. Oh, uh, there's a lady who's here looking for her sister lost in the woods and there are lots and lots and lots of very vicious wolves. Mmm, rotten food. Perfect for my dwarven physique. Gimme. Oh. You don't want to eat that. Wrong! I do want to eat that. What if one of these is illusory and I just thought my dick into it hard enough? No? Shame. Mmm. God, I had the feeling there's more in here. I could peek the map and cheat, but I don't want to. Like, auto map is just so I don't have to make my own map in the reels, but like, I'm not going to give myself undue knowledge. My DM will yell at me again. Like, how the fuck am I a level 5 fighter? I don't know that fairies are weak to cold steel. Like, nah, -uh, you don't have that knowledge. Like, are you the dip? Level 5 fighter is like several years of doing this shit, dude. Or a great and mighty quest. Womp. I have the feeling we just barge into their room. Unless I can, like, read one of the graves. I'm gonna say before I do this, in case there is a horrifying, like, vampire creature in here, and I die. V12! I protest I will not be part of your desecrated graves. You're gonna do this. You'll have to do it without me. Cool! My lawful good cleric says, nah -uh. That's my main character, too. Like, he can fuck right off. Apparently. You'd think that wouldn't be a person that you, your, uh, your uh, custom character would have personality. Burr. Oh, yeah. See, it revealed a little bit of the temple there, too. That might be... Hall. Okay, it's definitely not a visual bug. You guys see that? <gasps> no. Well, it pops up with stuff for me. Yeah, I, I think that's definitely a, uh, like, when it loads maps, it renders the center briefly. And then the auto mapper picks up on that. Can I, like... Noop around. Carving of the four winos. Man, if this is a real d and I'd say have our uh, thief sneak in there while we distract the guards. We can't even talk to again. I think I got it, right? 
My inner good boy says find another way, but my outer this is a video game says just do it. Is there a way to stealth? All right. Breaking and entering time. There's music in this place. It occasionally goes... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Oh! <gasps> this is the catacombs. The catacombs look ancient and evil. We be concerned over the clerics. Holy shit, it's a dungeon hack keyhole! Look, we didn't kill them, right? Oh. Oh, they almost did. I wish I could make just the sound effects louder. Have you guys gone back to your posts, or do we have to kill you? Well, they're attacking us. The priests of the Dark Moon are not very priest-like. Ow. So they appear to be shooting, like, magic missile at me. That's not very cleric-y. Eh. Bonk. These guys hurt quite a lot. Oh, crap. He didn't die, did he? No, he's, like, blue and has a slight amount of HP left. Are you only unconscious? I think he's only unconscious. Also, Cure Light Wounds is jack shit. Well, uh... Wall of the West seems solid, but I feel a small draft. Ooh. Yeah, see? That's our thief saying that. Okay. Uh, hopefully that doesn't come back to... Oh. We're trapped in here now. To bite us in the ass. They were evil, right? Like... <laughs> probably, right? Right, right? <laughs> oh, fuck. Do I have cure serious? No, I have poison. Uh, slow poison is not nearly as good as neutralized poison. Because if this is AD and D, unless it's changed for video game purposes, slow poison never removes it, and the poison will still inevitably kill you. <laughs> Man, uh, my healing sucks ass. It's not resting for 150 hours like fighters in dungeon hack. Although we might have to if I didn't have the healing. Oh, dear God. Did I get my healing back? No. Okay, that's fine. Oh, shit. Except, right. Protection from evil is... Painful is what it is. Right? Ow is right! Like, the, the nice spells are just like, oh, it's all pleasant and fancy. Then, nails on the chalkboard for protection from evil. Going up. Hi! I am startled by an angry priest. That was scary! Talk about an angry priest, he sternly explains, My children, these are our private chambers, you must leave! The other guy is trying to kill me! Attack! I genuinely wonder if there is another way to get around them. We 
everything. We have super high AC. Hopefully they aren't innocent people. I mean, he was wearing a awful lot of spikes on his armor. We're definitely going to be, like, retroactively justified when we find horrifying, like, demon altars in here, right? God, I wish I had detect, like, evil and not protect from... <laughs> Shit. Man, yeah, hopefully that wasn't a terrible, terrible mistake. I didn't see any other way to do it, though. Like, I figured there was, like, a hook of go back into the forest and find the kid, and through there you'd find, like, an alternate way. But, no, it was just barge past the priests and aggro them. Although, I guess I didn't necessarily have to go back up and kill them. I could have just ran. Or the cattle cones. <gasps> There's nothing there. Oogie. Oh, hi! The right guard styles and says, We don't like thieves, does we? Left guard responds, You scuttle hero, let's finish him off and go back to sleep. <coughs> I'm not a thief, I'm an adventurer. I am legally entitled to smash all your pots. Here, I thought there was gonna be like undead down here. No, go away, Thagar. God, he has such RuneScape sound effects. Oh, nope. We have a wand. What is this? Scepter of Kingly Might. Potion of Giant Strength. I wonder if that casts... Rank. Eleven. So, so we're, we're definitely going to be like, Retroactively justified, right? I'm not tanking my lawful alignment, am I? I'm still lawful good, even though I've murdered five people in cold blood without known justification. You know, on my clerically hunch. Ooh. Oh, neat. Pressure plate. Oh, I need a rock. Anything I can just leave on the floor. Oh, yeah, you can see it right there on the door. Okay, I do have the key now. I'm going to go back and try it on the door. <sighs> yeah. Oh, crap, dudes. I figured there's going to be like undead or something horrible down here that would immediately justify it. No, it's just human guards. But what are they guarding? You wouldn't need this many guards for a crappy little temple in the woods, right? The wolves can't be that much of a problem. You only attack the left one because you're on the left. I don't want to hear the footsteps and stuff, but... Never close the pit, but it's the only part of the trap. This is only part of the trap. I'm assuming it uncloses once we're across. Uh, let's explore the rest of the place first before we go daring through doors and shit that could close behind us. Hi! Yes, that's nice. Eh, kill. A bunch of short people just broke into the temple, started slaughtering everybody, saying it's in the name of adventure. And hopefully goodness, accidentally, after the fact. I was gonna say, maybe you could sneak past those uh, two guards. 
if you were quick about it and like don't be adjacent to the space that they're on. But uh, there's a lot of guards in here. We're just murdering people. Did the wizard what's his face say anything about like he guaranteedly knows that shit's fucked in here? And to show no mercy to the to the locals. Oh, nice. My rings of sustenance do not appear to be giving us sustenance. Man, these retro graphics and this music really make me want to play RuneScape. I should have brought some rocks from the woods. Hopefully we can get the axe on the way out, or Rusty Dagger. Nice. Sounds like someone humming this. Oh! Oh, 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 wait. Speaking of random noises, before I forget, there was a secret passage up in the temple that Mr. Rogue Man found. What? Oh yeah, here. <gasps> Fancy! Ooh. You know what I just realized? Plaque reads, death be undone by B, but I shall only grant three. I could have made completely different characters than Dorum and Tagor. Because, like, they're NPCs that I picked up in the Eye of the Beholder game, the first one. Because you only start with two characters, and then you pick up a party of six, so four extras. Or maybe it was three. Something like that. Or maybe you make four and pick up two more. I don't know. Um, I was thinking, if these are the only four characters we get through the entire game, I might want to like quickly restart, uh, since I can just breeze through the game and uh, make two custom characters. But like, sweet dwarven frontline. Also, this is a continued from the last game. Like, it's fine. Yeah, death be undone by me, but I shall only grant three. These are either very lich-like, or I can just go in here and it resurrects my people. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> However, there's another teleporter here. Ooh. I shall only grant three. Okay, so we have three. Resurrection spots. Oh dear god! They've duplicated! That was a lot of clerics! Uh, let's buff up. And do it. Let's just kill them all. I don't think we quite need this much healing, but I can just create food and water. Alright, close your ears, kids. This is gonna hurt. Ah! RuneScape playthrough when? I don't even know what I do in a RuneScape playthrough. Eh, I guess I could focus on doing actual quests and stuff for once, instead of just fucking around in Castle Wars. Or the ones that people play anymore, which was something I don't remember. There's some mini games that people still do. I don't think Castle Wars is one of them. Although they do have like organized events of like, here is a thing where we're trying to get players together to actually play these old mini games, which was very nice of them. YouTube. Stop that. Quit it. I don't need internet. I have internet. Iron Man Nightmare Mode? What the fuck is Nightmare Mode? 
I know what Iron Man is, but what's Nightmare Mode? Have you played Heretic in the Hex City? Yes, a long time ago, though. Into old days, before the streamy times. Who resurrected all of these clerics, like, twice over, though? Darn. Darn. <laughs> Oh my god, there's like more behind there too. Where did these come from? They just summoned the entire cult. Bring. I think we have all these blessings and protect from magic and stuff on. Or protect from evil. They're probably evil, right? Like, they're not hitting us nearly as much as they were before. It could be the other, like, four buffs. Or it could be protection from evil. Fired eleven times. Eat plus whatever log sword. Oh, if you take damage at all, you die. No, God, God, no. I've been watching that series. Oh, it looks horribly anxiety-inducing. Although, I could do it where if you take any damage, you die, but it's not permanent. I guess that would be the hardcore part, wouldn't it? I wouldn't mind doing group Iron Man, though. Like, that always seemed fun, but... I never managed to, to wrangle friends around enough. Do you just spawn now?! Also, I think the last time I, like, properly entertained the attempted idea of Group Iron Man, uh, it didn't exist in OSRS. It was only an RS3 thing. Where did you fuckers come from? You just spawning in the walls? Probably. Well, free experience points. YouTube, please, fuck off. God damn it. Uh-oh. 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 The trap! It's trapped us! Oh. Oh, these guys kind of hurt. Quick, cure light winds. Maybe they're all vampires that I can, like, turn undead. Be part foul creature. Wait, did that actually get rid of one? Or is that coincidence? And he just happened to die. I think it was just Koei Ooh, key. Ooh, key. Want to buy a magic quiver. Or infinite ammo bow. Ow! You know, I didn't actually expect it. 
uh, to let you do that. Problem. We are now below the pit. I'll have a grappling hook. Gotta be a, a way to get this open, though. These two? Yeah. Oh, fuck. What have I done? Fucking Twitch with their in-video ads that are lately. YouTube's been doing that, too. Thankfully, uBlock has been able to block most of them. But it still, like, fucks up and fails to, like, render the actual video. This is an old-ass D&D game, so it could very well be you fall in here, and it's just over. Um... Yeah, and everything I could possibly need to do is gonna be on screen. Because I don't think, like, these games are entirely playable. Uh, these games are entirely playable with mouse only. Hmm. Shit. I just have to reload. Game over. Maybe I have to right click instead? Uh oh. <laughs> oh no. I don't have like. A recall or anything, right? No recall or intervention could work at this place. Fucking goddammit, YouTube! Can I go get the entire RuneScape soundtrack on Spotify instead so you stop this crap? RuneScape. Uh, oh, there is the original soundtrack. I don't think this is all of them, though. There's 44 on here. Is this, like, the original original or three? And this is, uh... Yeah, this is only the soundtrack that they, like, officially released, though. For purchase. Not every track in the game, because every track in the game is like 550. Generally just Brave Browser fixed everything for me. I, I lived it. What do you think I'm using, Hobo? You think I'm like a sane person who's not too paranoid to use Google Chrome? Or just wants to save on my fucking stupid bullshit? Uh. I think I'm just dead. I think I have to reload it. Which means I better start saving and loading a lot more often. Or, well, saving a lot more often. Because now I have to kill all the frickin' cult losers. Welcome. Welcome to the Sanctum. We really like your vibe. My husband and I are wondering if you're up for an adventure. Why are you always cucks? I got others adblock plus. I don't have adblock plus because I replaced it with uBlock Origin because uh, adblock plus stopped working after YouTube threw a hasty fit or Google threw a hasty fit at them or some shit like a while ago. 
and they said, we're going to do our best. Or is it because they were e-bagging? I think that was it. It's YouTube threw a hasty fit, or Google threw a hasty fit about ads or some shit. And so, like, every, like, fucking couple of hours or whatever, I'd get a pop-up with an entire new tab. Uh, no, not swapping. Stop that. Uh, on my web browser would just pop up and go, YouTube or Google is doing bibba -da -bibba -da -bibba. Please donate. I'm like, no, fuck off. I'm poor. If I weren't poor, I'd be playing Space Marine 2 right now. But we're playing this $5 game because I couldn't afford the $60 game. I think it came out today. Uh-oh. Look at me here. Speaking of that, is it today or tomorrow? Might be tomorrow. Bless Marin. Blah, 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 blah. Mostly positive. 80%. Oh, no, it unlocks the night. God damn it. Okay. This time... This time... That wasn't actually me going down the stairs. That was my spell <laughs> going away. This time... We save before I accidentally leave the hole. Do not haul. Why am I saying the words do not hold made me briefly lightheaded? What the fuck? This is why he gives me the rock and stones. Kinda sad I can't go back to the woods. It was full of puppies and cute. And here's a little cat comb I found I was super proud of. Like, that was super cool. Because, like, the first game I remember doesn't have anything like that. It's just this gameplay, and you kind of got to fill in the gaps yourself. Charge! God, I wish I had a spear. I'm pretty sure I had a spear at the end of the last game. Removing useless and overpowered items. It's a pointy stick is not overpowered. It's historically overpowered. Looking at Urum, all I think is that he needs to get that one mod that makes the Skyrim faces less blocky. As uh, on vanilla Skyrim, or at least Legendary Edition, because I'm an old fart that refuses to update to the Special Edition because I don't want to spend hours refinding every single Special Edition version of every mod that I have. Uh, for some reason, like, just the noses and, like, the upper cheekbones of every character is really low poly. And I'm pretty sure it's an error. But it do be doing that for some reason. Yeah, mail. I have play you have plus three banded mail. What do you got? Hay mail. I honestly probably want to give him the plate mail. Yeah, what? Why does my frontliner not have the better armor? Is it not better armor? Negative two. Yeah, he had like a negative. Yeah, zero. Negative two. I wonder if he had like dragon scale armor or something from the previous game. And it nerfed it. But didn't, you know, strip him naked. Anyways, it looked exactly like that. It was crusty. 
That was, I think, one of the first mods I ever got for Skyrim when it first came out. I went, wow, that's bad! So I just looked up, like, face fix. The complaint I saw, thanks to part, probably due to ugh, epic and needing three different accounts to play on a game on fucking Steam. That's wrong, also. It's the same shit that people were bitching about, about uh, Helldivers 6. Not Helldivers. Uh, EDF 6 is the game uses Epic server hosting for their online functionality. So it launches a like minor Epic server connection, like background software with the game. That's literally it. Like you don't have to make an Epic account. You don't have to log in. It just, the only thing you had to do with um, EDF6 was like enter a username so it has something to like tether to your game instance in order to connect that name with other accounts to enable online functionality. People were overblowing that shit hard. Mostly because people uh, immediately got hyper outraged about it and assumed it was the same thing as what uh, Helldivers 2 did when it wasn't. It was a completely different story. But that was still fresh in people's minds, so when EDF came along and it popped up Epic for server functionality as a backend, people freaked the fuck out, assuming it's like, uh, assuming it was the same thing. Like, no, it wasn't. So kind of, I believe that's the exact same thing that Space Marines 2 is doing. I don't know 100% because I didn't look into the Space Marine one, but I looked into the uh, EDF2 one and it was fucking nothing. A naked dude? Are you friends? Nope. Kill. Why is he nude? Shit. Why do some of your guards not have clothes? Can I come? Oh, violence? Okay. Ill. Yeah, the game briefly pauses whenever enemies are attacking, which is messing up my trying to attack. Like, I know your animation is pretty, but it's kind of annoying. I'll get used to it, though. I'm pretty sure the first game had that problem, too. I remember bitching about something eerily similar. All I had to do is button mash. Ew. Gimme. That is hard and uncomfortable. Oh, is that why they're naked? I literally just woke them up. Oh, cool! Free knife! <laughs> just an old dagger in there. Do I need a dagger? No. Am I taking it anyways? Uh-huh. wonder if I can attack from the back line. What is this? Axe. Axe. Longsword. If I put on a longy sword, and I... Oh, no, because it's grayed out. Oh, I could, like, try to find a crossbow or something. That'd be nice. There's a lot of key doors here, and... Uh, ooh, that one's fancy. And a lot of keys that I don't have for them. Holy shit, Nudimans! Oh, there's an even bigger guy in the back. Or is he just a more different big guy? Oh, so these guys kind of hurt.
Oh. Well, if they are evil, they're about to start hitting a lot more. Or maybe slightly more. I don't know if protection from evil is one AC in AD&D, or if it's like three because it's one per like four levels or something. Which would make it two. But we do seem to be getting a little bit more spotin'. But it might be just me imagining stuff. Eh, chunky. No ammo. I think we'll be fine. There's a nude dude and two left. And the guy in the background is ADHDing it up. Like, please! I just wanna fight! Let me at him! Roar. Uh oh, and we're leaving. Goodbye! Kelvin, no! Or not Kelvin. I like that they get unconscious first instead of fucking dead. Kill! Anything I can do. Nope. We got our front line of fighters. They do most of the heavy lifting. Kinda wish I had a wizard. I think I remember making a wizard in the first game and then going, ah, 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 we, no, no, get out of here. We got dwarf team. That or they were one of my back slots and I can't, couldn't bring them up. Because it, it, it made me do two people and not, or four people and not six. Arrow, arrow. Arrow. I think these are the guard barracks. That would explain all the naked people. Aww. <gasps> Parchment! And the North Wino. Okay, we are going to rest it up in here. And while my people do that, I'm going to go to the bathroom. <gasps> the restroom. Wow! Be back. Hey! I'm gonna mute myself. Are you guys listening to me rambling and raving? Me having rhetorical conversations with myself. Autistically. Is that one we need a. Uh. They're so very naked! I was gonna say, I think we need a key for that door. Uh, no! They came out to me. It's the last mistake they'll ever make. Ouch. Ouch. You know, for having no armor, these guys really take a hate a beating. <gasps> Gray key. Ooh. What is more like a jail cell? Going down. Did I go down? Oh yeah, I'm in the lower left now. 
Oh, hold on. Oh, that's cute. Except I only saw that because it's on the map here. Uh, can I hide that? Maybe, but that falls under buttons, too. Even if they're buttons that reveal secrets. I can hide it. Oh, no, they kept the other, the other buttons on. It's only slightly cheating, and we got a piece of crap, and... That one's actually pretty nice. How many fucking dies? All's light wounds, bless, raise dead. Rare, bliss. Aid, flame blowy. Neutralize poison, cure critical winos. Detect magic, protection from evil. I have to go to my Pathfinder session to starting soon. Ooh, you have a good time. I have Pathfinder after stream. <laughs> ah! And I'd blab and tell you what I'm gonna do because I am the DM. But uh, one of my players watches these streams, so uh, shh. Besides, the accounts at Space Marine is always online, so you couldn't solo grind unless they change that in less than a week. How does that prevent you from solo grinding? Also, what the hell is there to even solo grind? Or do you mean like you can't fight against bots in multiplayer to get the levels and unlock the armor bits? YouTube, please, fuck off. Because if it's anything like Space Marine 1, there's the single-player campaign, which I think is co-op now. Um, was it co-op before? I don't remember. Uh, and then there's like a PvP mode, which is shoot there. Which was very fun. I used to play the shit out of that when uh, Space Marine 1 was... <sighs> Over the page with this symbol, is it pussy? Yes, it's pussy. Which is weird. Ow! I still have other shit up here I want to do. It's like, there's a whole other side of this. And I believe I have keys. Yeah, I have a key for the other side. Yeah, I used to play the shit out of Space Marine 1's uh, multiplayer. To the point I was, like, one of the best players in the world. <laughs> Not a lot of people. Hey. Eh. Not a lot of people play the online, but like among the couple hundred that there was at the time. I was really fucking good with a uh, bolt pistol and a knife. Like everybody underestimated. Everybody's over here with like the big hammer and, and, and the pew pew pew. Meanwhile, I just had knife. Guy who ran up to I didn't even play a freaking assault marine. Like I was a a, a light dude. That just ran up to people, would just bang, bang, bang as I approached them with the bolt pistol. And then once I got up to him, shoved the knife in their face hole, and they died. It was surprisingly effective. I think the bolt pistol ended up being... It's the same damage as the bolter. Uh, and I think it's more accurate. Yeah, because the bolter is automatic. So like pop 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 and then they're getting hit and plunking and and their aim is thrown off while i'm just sitting up and walking to them and going haha die heretic <laughs> it was real good and hopefully when i can afford money and if the multiplayer is any good oh god the guard has spotted the party helix anger hey how'd you get in here stop right there oh knife is this implying that I could have come in here without the guard seeing me? That I have been sneaky, I just haven't been. Ooh. 
Who knows? Maybe I get it doing it. I don't like uh, multiplayer shooter stuff as much as I used to. Oh, magic dust. Snort it. Does this stack at all? Oh no. What do you think it does? What do you think it does? I want to eat the Grodian Rotten Rations. My choice. It's my player agency. Don't you take it away from me. Fuck you. I want to make bad choices. Uh, <gasps> Ooh. Be merciful, but allow. It's humming and coming from that door. A voice within the cell which says, Please help me watch out. Guaros everywhere. Uh. I believe. Yeah. A child or a halfling? Oh, great heroes. Thank you for your time and rescue. I am in Saul the Quick, and I was seeking the forest. I was seeking refuge in this temple from the walls of the forest. No sooner had I borrowed some food when the clerics captured me and placed me in the cell. Please free me, and I'll make a valuable addition to your team. I read that as abortion to your team. <laughs> oh, the potato of scaling is great. Free from his chase while you joined your party. Yes! Do not regret this, by the way. Can I have any food or weapons I can borrow? I mean, he has been down here. Are you sure you're not a child? I know he's gonna be a halfling, right? Halfling male. He looks even, like, childish for a halfling. Mean's got 17 dexterity and 19 con. Also, holy crap, he is on the verge of starvation, yeah. Here, take some iron rations. Uh, I don't have anything for him to do. Is the problem? Because I'm pretty sure my ranged weapons all died with the uh, two other characters that I couldn't bring forward from the other game. Oops. God damn it, YouTube! Man, the music was doing just fine before. I want to get Adblock Plus back. They stopped advertising aggressively at me. Ugh. Just don't do the thing. Don't just don't just don't do the thing. I'm surprised Adblock Plus is allowed on the Chrome Web Store, considering how much of a bitch fit Google made. Okay. Any, like, secret... So this is just like the first game. Where you start with a party of four. I thought it was a two because of the two characters that I have here. But no, I had four. I replaced them with Urum and Tagger. For glorious dwarf party. God, I probably need to go back and, uh... Look for buttons in other places, huh? Like there might, no, because there's not going to be any that any hidden buttons that I missed before I turned off the uh, show hidden buttons thing, which I guess is on by default because they're really easy to miss. But like that's the point. Fancy. <gasps> Spiders! Oh no! Uh, one second. One second. One moment. Damn it. I only have one neutralized poison. Fuck. Ugh. Grr. Pain. Well, we're just gonna have to do the uh, poison enemy strat from the first game. Which is, save the game between every combat, and if you get poisoned, reload. The secret patch is long ago forgotten. We better be careful. Ooh. Uh -huh. Any buttons on these walls? 
Secret buttons in secret passages. How about it's not working? Oh, Skeleton! Aw. Ancient bones crumble to dust. I want set of bones. Oh yeah, I should probably like read the parchment that I found before. How do I read? You may only eat food. Okay, how to read though? Put it. Oh, do I have to like put it in my hands? Here you go, Insel. You can be our scribe who carries all of our crap. Oh look, neutralized poison, huh? Hmm, there was a copper key upstairs for a key though, right? One of the um private quarters. Boris, commander of the Garos! This is one of the four horns. They must not fall to the wrong hands. I repeat, they must not. Together they can be used to break the seal. J. Oh, that's cute! It's a map of the dungeon! Oh, and it shows you where a secret passage is! <gasps> Wait, no! Yeah, that's right here. That means right here, there's a secret door that goes around here. Cool! Oh, that's cool. I like that I can cross-reference it with my own map. Wait. Add no secret. I don't think that worked. I don't know. Apparently it has. Am I like... There's a clue book? Oh, neat! Rule book. Laugh at death! Thanks. Unexplore tweaks. What's tweaks do? Relaxed item restriction identified items. Is this like actually do shit in the game? That'd be cool. Not just a I guess yeah, it's pinging off the game to see where I am in the windows. Fucking music. Okay, there we go. It's just because I don't have it revealed. Spoiler! Gross. Give me a neutralized spoiler for the giant spider that's probably around here somewhere. What have you been eating? What have you been doing? I'm not down here all the times. <gasps> that him? <gasps> Something wicked this way comes! Yeah! Ow, you fucker. Sneaking and hanging from the ceiling, I bet. Where's my arachnophobia mode that turns everything into a crab and it's hilarious? Crab invasion. <laughs> That's it, nothing over here except for a little circle. It actually knitted up the spider web there too. Unless. Any potentially secretive buttons? No, just some spiders and experience points. Hey, I'll take it. Uh, I wish I could scroll this back up, but some people leveled up. I think it was me and John Boy. Ooh, does that mean I have more spells? Five, five, four. Ooh, yeah, there, I got another one of these. Maybe we do one create food. Hey, we can get a cure serious wounds going on. I think we don't do poison, and then if we just get poisoned, we reload, because poison's so fucking annoying in old editions. There was something back there. It was called experience points. Oh! 
Free key. That means there's another key somewhere. Or another lock somewhere. Because that was the key for his cell. But I had another key that I used. Yeah. I'm surprised it didn't drop anything that I completely blinded, right? Can you like open this playlist in Firefox or something for it to fucking work properly? I'll do it and have. Now, if I go to the next one, does it immediately get stuck? No. Yeah, it might just be a chromium thing. Because chromium tends to be ass at certain junctures. Okay, do we have another door on this here map? Somewhere. I don't see any unexplored areas. I do see a dead fruit fly, though. Eh, <laughs> sucker. In a couple days, hopefully I won't have to deal with them, because in the 11th, I'm probably not streaming. Uh, it's Wednesday anyway, so I don't. It's my day off. Uh, I'm probably not streaming or doing anything Wednesday, because I'm going to be sleeping the entire rest of the day, because fucking... <sighs> they're coming in to rip out my window and replace it, which means it's probably going to be at, like, 9 a.m., and I'm going to wish to die for several hours. <gasps> yeah, that was not the right. Oh, it is in the center. Never mind. Very good. Fuck yeah. Is there a key door in here? It goes if down if Morith. I was gonna say this probably goes down to the cell that you fall into, which I do wonder how you're supposed to get out of. <laughs> tink tink tink. Huh. How do they expect you to get out of this, like, if you fall down the pit? There's no buttons. You're just screwed. Although, if I do get another key, I can open that door. There's no other doors for me to use this other gray key on. Unless it's down much lower. But before that, let's go uh, snoop around the cleric's rooms. Look, they kidnapped the child. I told you, I am vindicated in post always. Might do horribly evil things were it done to somebody who's not evil, but eventually I prove that they are. Nice. Now that looks pretty evil and spooky. Disturbing and particular. Hmm. Oh, this is an entire upper area. I thought it was gonna be like a little bedroom. Oh no. You wish to listen. <gasps> the word female says that feeble minded hag her foolishness could ruin our plans. Melee's answers co confidently. What difference does it make? For the time being, she serves us well. In fact, in the past few days, she has brought us three more victims. Say hey, they're evil! Thanks for the one replies. Dran whisks. Of course, all by using her. She's getting impatient and soon she will abandon hope. If this happens, I'm sure she will inform the militia. Sistedly, he snaps. It's not wise to speak ill of... Is it Dran or Orin? 
You must watch your words or you will share the same fate as her and her family. Soon she will join us in death as well. Your equivalent with a female voice, of course. I would never criticize his plan. If you are right, we should continue to... Did I do something for the corridor? Hello! Time to die! See, they're awfully pointy for good guys. A good person would never wear spikes on their armor. At all. Ever. No, no, no. These guys kind of fucking hurt. Ow. His gigantic mustache will be a great loss to this world, but... It is a necessity. Not his mustache's fault that its uh, grower decided to be an evil bastard and kidnap the halflings and other type things. This bed feels very unforgiving. It is also it is, it is very made of black stone, which means that it is an evil bed. Oh, fuck. We take him. Nah, I should probably go rest. Oh, fuck. Of arrows I missed. Can I rest down here or is it going to spawn more clerks? Let's find out. Yeah, and I should have really good healing spells to use on them. Oh, see? Nice. Doo -doo -doo -doo. I like how In Saul's portrait is just perpetually going to be fucked up. Like, this guy has a black eye for life. Oi, you fucker! What did he steal? Did he steal a bunch of my rations? Wait, that little fuck! Yeah, I don't think I'm missing anything except for this, which was a bunch of rations and maybe a few potions. Hey, uh, nothing I'm too worried about. Maybe the little bastard was in here for a reason. Oh, he left me a note. You prick. He didn't steal Dorum's sword, did he? Oh, you fuck- Really?! God damn it. Yeah, I'm not losing a fucking plus four longsword to that dweeb. Yeah, I don't mind losing this, but like, really? My stupidly good weapon? him out of the party. It's like, we fed you? Yeah, fuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah! Just gone. God, I should probably keep him for, like, if it's plot related, you know? He did leave a note. even dropped like some scrolls and shit you couldn't you couldn't have dropped less useful stuff hold this
full of nut poison. Well, you don't suppose. There's a quick save function. Wait, is there? Oh, hell yeah. Get crit, loser. Get crit, loser. <laughs> Maybe if I heal him, he'll feel guilty enough. This is why I have people on watch. That's not him. Little fooker. Yeah, I can conjure food out of thin air, you'd think. The starving vagabond like he would think maybe there is more strategy to sticking with the poop. The group. God, I really need to try the Grimrock 2 randomizer again. Maybe it's been updated a shitload since I last tried it, like, years ago. I don't think there's anything down here. Neatly enough, the uh, auto map stays filled in. On reload. I don't have to go, shit, where is that one thing? Fuck, oh god, oh god, oh shit, oh fuck. This is the wrong way. This is down deeper. I don't want to go down deeper. I want to go up. Well, maybe we should, because, like, it, it seemed like there was plot relevance above. Yeah. Yes, we do. And then save before I rest in case what he takes is entirely random. And he'll just fuck off with some scrolls. And potions and rations. Little bastard. Heal him, we feed him. Those fuckers. Did you pay me? Dora has caught Insol trying to steal from him in the night. Insol, uh, his head is bashed in. You fucker! Yeah, like. Pre yeah, the only thing he takes is six slots here in his weapon. He left me a key, or is that the key that I gave him? That was the key that I gave him. Like, I don't care if he takes a crappy weapon to, to be on his way. Is it because I didn't give him a weapon here? Because he did ask for a weapon. Maybe he only takes from that one slot, and uh, we can rig the game a bit. Maybe that was it. If you don't give him a weapon, he takes a weapon. If you don't feed him enough, he takes food. And potions for healing. I don't know. That would be kind of neat. 
if I like heal him properly, does he fuck me less? sword now I need those you asshole I refuse to let him have my cool swords they are dumbly good doesn't take anything else. He even leaves his one long sword. It's a fucking piece of shit. Take one of the axes and be gone, you crap heap. I welcomed you into this house and you fuck my life! How could you? Okay, my long swords are still there. He took potions and rations. And nothing else. Did Dorm have rings? Yes. Or is that me? No, he had a ring of sustenance and stuff. Yep. Guessing he's scripting is that he takes the first rings uh, from the party and the first, like, magical weapons. If he is able. <laughs> Just in case. I'm gonna lose my cool shit for the last game. Fuck you. Okay. What did you run off with this time? Did you have bracers? I don't think so. You ran off with that axe. That's fine. And unless one of us had bracers. Nothing else. Lil bastard. No, not lol bastard. Okay. Fine, you can have that, you piece of shit. Tomorrow I'm gonna wonder what the fuck LOL RTB means. Roll the bones. <sighs> mm. 
Neat longsword, rig of adornment. Adornment. Necklace of adornment. Protection for the guy who doesn't have the bracers. Sustenance, which doesn't work, I'm pretty sure. Backup stewards. You know, for when thieves are around, stealing my shit. Son of a bitch. Yeah, one of these notes is from him. Brave adventurous, sorry to leave so soon, but I must have Starfire for myself. I took a few things. I'm sure you won't miss them. Ha! Ha! Sure you won't miss them, huh? This place is full of secrets. Look upon the northeastern wall near my old cell. I think I already did that. Yeah, that went down to the spider den. Uh Sure, you won't miss them. If you had taken, like, just the axe, sure. Okay, Starfire for himself. I'm probably gonna find him dead later on, then. Or find him there later on, and him going, I'm so sorry! I did not want to do, but my hand was forced by the woes of poverty. We are underground, far underground. But before us is vast, dark, and still, it appears to be long abandoned. Abandoned. Yes, but it's also very rock and stone down here. Any secrets on these walls? Ooh, that's a fancy keyhole. Maybe I should turn on buttons on the auto map. Just so I don't have to do this the entire game. <laughs> yeah, but it's so much more riveting to actually find one. Even if I am scraping my face against the wall. Oh my god, like that! A well-traveled path leads through this wall. See, that's some cool shit. Because if you go by it, there's a chance for somebody to mention it. Potion of Vitality. Cure Poison. Looks like a good place to hide things. Duh. Duh. You mean the potions, or... Is there a secret within a secret? Where's the text in auto scroll if there wasn't something replacing it? You sure this looks like a good place to hide things? There's not part of the original construction. Were they replaced? Oh! Oh. oh. Wait, someone has it. I thought I had another iron key. Shit. Was there another gray key somewhere that I meant to pick up? But I reloaded and I didn't get it again? Oh, fuck. Did I use it somewhere? No. There's... Hmm. Yeah, because there was the key to the guy's cell, and then I was like, oh, there's another key that I, that I used the, one, the first great key on, and then I went, oh, there's another one on this pedestal. Oh, did I just leave it on the fucking pedestal on my second? Yes, because I got it coming back from the spiders, and I never got it on my second coming giggity of back from the spiders.
Ah! Yeah, northeast wall near his cell. Pretty sure he just means this one. Unless... Oh, I hear footsteppies. Y'all best stay away if you don't want to become experience points. Oh, how could you? Also, I am 90% sure the Ring of Sustenance does nothing <laughs> in this one. Because he has it on. He shouldn't be uh, getting hungry. Or if he is, he should be getting hungry very, very slowly. Ring of Sustenances suck anyways. They remove a fun, vital element of, like, any survival bit in these in, in the tabletop. Which is a reason why I don't allow it or create food and water in my campaigns. Like, if, uh, if, you, if you're genuinely low on rations, play it out. Go hunting. Go, I don't know, eat rocks and stones. Figure something out. Like, I'm never going to let you starve, starve. Unless you, like, literally go 30 days without eating or something. Like, you're going to be hungry and fatigued. Like, go outside the dungeon. Go hunting for a while. Taunting. Role play! Oh! Yes. Is this like find all the extra keys or don't let the asshole out? Ooh. Yeah, you can see the influence for dungeon hack, right? Like this is just the skull door from from dungeon hack. This hole looks charred. Ooh. Oh, look at those particle effects. Oh, that's cute. Does mean there's like something spooky in here? I can lure it in there. Can I make this smaller? Can I adjust the window size of the... No, but I can crash it. Whoops! <laughs> Don't touch the top bar too much. Gotcha. There you go, back. Yeah, there is a clue book. Does this just have maps and stuff in it? Mantis Warrior. That's a Thrycreen, sir. Oh yeah, it does. It has a map of every level with all like the secrets and stuff. Ah, oh, that's cute. A little clue book. Reset progress. Let's not. Also, controls. Is there anything new in here? Is there? I like how <laughs> you can open your party's inventories with the F keys. Uh, it has a picture of Insol on here with the rest of them. Insol is dead. <laughs> To swap the position of the first two characters, hold shift and press the function key that corresponds. <laughs> oh no. Uh, is there a quick save? Press M to manipulate the object in the 3D view. Oh cool, so I can press M. And if there is something to interact with on a wall, even if I can't like see it with my peepers. Cast a spell with space. I'm pretty sure these don't apply uh, with me just clicking. Oh, keybinds. One second, I'm reloading it. There it goes. Alright. Gimme. Cram this in the corner. Who is your destiny? Okay, now... 
Don't fuck with this too much, but... No, there does not seem to be a way for me to resize it. I can minimize it. That's it. And I have this, whatever that thing is, combat bar, quote unquote. Alright, I gotta run to the bathroom real quick. I'll be right back. Oh god, my map! Where'd it go? Better recapture it. Is it just itchy glitchy? The forest! No, the catacombs! Also, why is Advanced Dungeons and Dragons cut off? Get back down there, you skank. Oh, because it's... That's as high as it goes. Really? Oh, yeah, that is the top of it. It's just real crusty. Mmm, crust. Okie dokie. Uh, why did we last left off? Oh, fireball. I want to see the particle effect. Look at it. Whee! Oh, I love it. Right, where the fuck was I? Uh, I'm over in the corner that is under my game window. Fix that. Uh... My map didn't fill itself back out. Hold on, do I still have up here full up? Yeah. I believe I accidentally did not save it, somehow. Ugh, that means like all this shit's unmapped now. It's fine, we'll just run a circle. This over here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just so I don't get curious, unless I should be curious. Oh, there's nothing. Can I actually press M to open secret stuff? I should test that next time I find one. That way, instead of looking at the walls, I can just press whatever WASD key I want and then spam the M key. Illusionary wall! <laughs> okay! <laughs> what 
Wait, was this the wall where it said, this looks like a good place to hide things? I think it was. Yeah, was it? Because there was a... Yeah, yeah, yeah! This was the hidden wall, and then I got over here, and my guy said, this looks like a great place to hide things. There's no button on this wall. It's fake. And I actually ran into it by mashing the W key too much. This work? No. Wait. <gasps> skeleton. Oh, hell yeah! The skeleton appeared. Here you go, John. John, perfect! I got you a spooky skull! Why do you have Wolverine's goofy brother as me? I'm pretty sure that when I played the first game, you consented to this portrait. Like, it wouldn't be named after you if you weren't here. Look, I'll make it up to you by giving you bones. And skulls, apparently. Just can't go in that slot. This looks and smells of a prison block, do you think? Your favorite, your favorite, it's you! It's 2-bit and Scully. They're separate. You put it on your head? No? Can I put it in your hand? There you go. Perfect. See? That's a plus 5 dagger? Oh. Hmm. If only you were in, could, could reach the front with it. I need longer arms. You're a rogue. Uh-huh. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure you were here when I made these characters, you know, five years ago. I can't believe you don't remember it. I think there's someone alive in one of these cells. Is it a dwarf? A small starving dwarf. Why don't you call him small? Help me, please. Dwarf slowly picks himself up with a paid voice. Thank you, friendos. For saving me, who knows what the villainous clerics of this temple had planned for me? How do you come to be in prison within the cell? I am Shorn Diergar or Uriergar. I can't tell. The D's look like O's. A cleric of the temple... Of the stone axe, for months I have been haunted. Oh, sweet, we have a pocket healer now. I've been haunted by a vision of an ancient temple that's shrouded in orc cloth. I felt compelled to seek out that temple that I might battle the evil that I do work within. I traveled for four days to find this accursed place. When I arrived, I found no evil, just a sect of clerics that greeted travelers with open arms. I spent the night in the temple, and when I awoke, I was in this cell. Oh! Hold up. Hold up. Oh, he looks so sad. I mean, he is horrifically ma You're not malnourished. There are many rats in that cell. They are attracted to the stink of my feet cheese. Oh, oh, oh. Hold on. I want to test something real quick. If I... <laughs> is our entire party dwarves? Except for you. You're our token halfling. If I rest in the temple, do I end up in one of the prison cells? That's what I want to check. Is that another way to figure out, like, that the temple is full of evil rather than ignoring them uh, and barging in until they attack you? I'm okay with being Bill, though. See, it's perfect reference. Definitely intended. <laughs> Dwarf. And you. Oh, could I have transferred the entire party? You may only take four characters. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh. Level forest. Hold up. Oh. Dog! You gonna do you kill all puppers. I don't even know where I am. Out of my way, losers! Out of my way, loser! I'm sorry, is the forest random? No. No way in hell. Where am I? I don't recognize this. Oh, because the map is slightly shifted to the left because my window is, is different. If I enter the Temple of the Dark Moon, 
and they go, hello, welcome to our convent. And I go and, like, sleep in the corner. Or hell, sleep directly in front of them. Ah! But if I, like, expand to sp- What if I sleep for more than zero hours? Do I wake up inside a moldy prison cell? Ah! Damn it. I was hoping that would be another way to figure out how to, uh, that they're all evil, is get yourself kidnapped. Shorn! He doesn't have a holy symbol, though. That's okay, friend. You can borrow mine real quick. What level are you? Same as me. I'm just gonna have him be pure healer. I like the woof the sound the dogs make when they fight their paws at you so casually. They're very good boys and girls. You can create food. I actually probably need create food. But not yet. Move paralysis, dispel magic. Slow poison. All of the cures. Excellent. And now when we sleep, not inside the prison cell, that sounds like a terrible idea. We should get... Well, uh, yeah, fuck loads of healing. Oh, except we're not, because... Wait, do I not have my... Do I not do it because I don't have my the, the, the symbol on me? Thorn cast healing. Thorn cast healing. Yeah. Neat. It actually detects if you have the holy symbol in your hand. We need to find him his. <gasps> bones. More bones. Here you go, John. More bones for you. It's your favorite thing. Shorn looks very literally like you. Glorious dwarf beard. Incredibly depressed. Horrifically malnourished. Stop right there! Da -da -da. Kill! Oh, 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 fuck. Oh no, Shorn got held! I was gonna say, the perfect time for... Uh, fucking... Remove paralysis that I gave him. Fuck you. Got big maces. I don't like the look of them. Yeah, hold person laughs uh, for a bit. Can't believe the music ate our combat. Or er, combat ate our music. Quick. Smack him with the shield. He went right through his mustache. You wish your stash could grow that long? Have you tried ointments? Dr. Glover's Crowth Cream. Good for what ails you. Do not put on penis. The world is not ready for that. Ah! Uh, mace! You're a Dapper Dan man? Well, Dapper Dan is a styling cream, not like a growth aid. So you would be caught dead using like pomade or something. Mace. But... Unless Dapper Dan's like a two-for-one crim. Amazing go! Are you still watching? Yes, YouTube. Frick right off, you dookie. Bookie. <gasps> Sp 
spooky dookie. How about what? Ooh. Man, I thought gone. How about what are we playing uh, Ascension again so we can continue the quest of spooky dookie and creepy peepee? Show this passage leads somewhere? Question mark. Uh oh. Oh, no longer paralyzed. Fantastic. Let's. I don't know pain. I don't know what that means. Oh, I have removed paralysis. Shit. It'd be nice to know. Also, why the fuck don't I have, like, bless and stuff? I should have AIDS. <laughs> what do you mean no ammo? God, what'd you do with your bones? I put it in the wrong person's inventory, didn't I? Vanguard is hello. Hello. <laughs> Cure big wounds. You gave my arrows to Dorum. That's what I thought. Sorry, Dorum. These are John's arrows. I really wish there was automatic quiver picker up a ring. Like, click this and you automatically vacuum up all of your arrows. Or actually be able to just click the portrait. Booking him in the Duker was painful even for you. Really? You were having fun? Like, struggling horrifically and wanting to die? What kind of millennial are you? Ha ah, I was right. I'm like, hmm, surely this goes somewhere. Indeed. Oh. That's an AU. This head crusher does not look comfortable. Well, it looks like it would crush your head. Indeed. Sounds uncomfortable. Nothing in here but some rude dudes, I guess. Surely this patch is goes somewhere. Wow. It's fucking nothing. My map not save again. I'm having the strangest sensation of deja vu. Yes. The map didn't save again. I've been here before. Damn it. Crash the game again. I exited for some reason. Yes. I don't remember what. These stairs go up. Yeah, because I remember going, oh my god, I refound this and trying to fill out the map again when I accidentally did the thing and the thing and the thing. And that's where the first skull was. Where the fuck?
What happened to Mappin? This record's a key. Love this. No. Complete set of elf bones? Ha! Oh, yes, perfect. A dead elf in my pocket. The best rock and stone I could have ever wanted. Back up, latest save game. Uh, yes. Don't know if that'll come fix it doing the thing. Let me find a key. I have a key for the upstairs. And my newest, greatest dwarf friend. Glorious dwarf party. Oh, you can't see the mini-map! Where the hell did it go? Did I never put it back since I crashed it? Uh, Not that one. Yeah, there! Sorry about that. Did I ever go through here? I don't think I did. Because I went, hang on, there's... Oh, <gasps> holy shit, Death Knights! Um, Possibly just normal skeletons, but they look very dead and very nighty. It's fine? <laughs> get turnt, bitch! They did not get turnt. Quickly! Maybe you'll have more luck. They do not appear to be getting very turnt. I don't know what turn undead does in this game. Does it damage them or does it make them run? Woo! Oh, well, necromancy! Ow! Oh god! It kind of hurt. Except for that one time. I think it might be dealing AoE damage to them. Just a little bit. Ew. Who gives a skeleton armor? It's much more cost effective to have them drink all the milk. How many times can I use that? I would like to turn a dead. And then boom, Shorn becomes a skeleton himself. Shit, no, not like that. In AD&D, turn undead makes them run or destroyed outright. What the fuck was it doing there? Is it just failing repeatedly over and over? I'm an 8th level cleric for nothing. Let us rest in the skeleton hole. We're gonna need it. And then Shorn steals all my shit and runs off. God fucking damn it. No, no, the skeleton hole has been cleared of skeletons. I'm not gonna get boned in here. The honorable dwarf friend. Much better than a disgusting thief of a halfling. There's a lot of skeletons. There's one less skeletons than is in our party. Actually, technically there was five skeletons because we have a whole elf skeleton. Skeleton, if you will. Oh my god, skeletons! That one still has its skin! Ow!
The skeleton. Oh no. No, not you. You're the good, disgusting halfling thief. There was another one who stole from us. And I had to reload several times because the skeleton appeared. And he, and he stole my, like, plus four long swords. Durham got a crazy low roll on that healing. Ooh. Oh, shit. Fuck, where do I need the silver key for? Probably just gonna be that door that's up there, but, like, the bottom door on the map was, uh, like, a skull key, and the far right one is, like, a void. Or obsidian. Probably just gonna be called the Dark Key. Why pick these? Oh, I should be trying that. Kinda wanna go back to the other one and see if I can pick them now. Maybe there just aren't keys to some doors. I miss these dungeon crawler grid based games. I and now you need to go try the uh, Legend of Grimrock 2's randomizer mod. It completely randomly generates a dungeon. And like, the whole shebang. It looks real cool. John, why are you terrible at locks? You're a rogue. This is why we brought you. Damn it. Makes you want to play Grimrock. Yeah. Uh, there is a randomly generated dungeon mod. Hopefully they've updated it a bunch since I last like looked at it. Where the fuck is my map? I have this all filled out and everything through like several. Does it only keep it? What? through this what, until you restart the game? God damn it! Yeah, that was where one of the silver key doors was. This is what I get for relying on technology. It kept my fucking note that I put down there, which is the exclamatey point. It, and it kept the front of this. It just cleared my fucking maps. That's lame. Oh, hi. Go away. I don't like your vibe. Right, I reset the game to what? to to see if resting in the front would get me kidnapped.
That's why there's two arrows here. It's because they shot up the stairs. Damn it. What's the point of having a thief? Oh, you know what happened? It reset because I started a new game. Guarantee you. The first time was because I closed the game uh, without actually like properly closing it through here. And it reset all the maps because I clicked new game and it probably deleted the previous map files. Hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Something, something. Kidnapping people, noise in the corridor, kill. Except Tagor is not going to have a good time here in a second. Oh, shit. Oh, and all of my buffs are gone. And Tagor is gone. Great. See ya. Uh-oh. Yeah. Quickly, heal the boy. Fuck! No, I just healed him, too! Oh, that's why the, the front of the temple was revealed. Because that's what I revealed when I, was, when I ran back to the new game to test it. Uh -huh. That's exactly what happened. Hello? Who the fuck is San Rawl? Wait. Can I resurrect the elf corpse I found? Hi, you're a drow. Yeah, elf male. I found a complete elf skeleton. And I have a wizard now. <laughs> oh, that's so cool! I didn't expect it to do that at all. I didn't even think of that. Yeah, that was the elf skeleton. Oh, your bone collection? It's okay, John. We'll get you more bones to collect. Shoot, he doesn't have a spell book, though. Hopefully we can find him one. Yeah, you are now the keeper of the scrolls. That's so cool that you can bring the elf skeleton back here. Man, dude, you've been dead forever. Actually, I want to see something. If I camp... And then prep... Create foobs. Yeah, I'll keep the one. Oh, that's some good healies. My party is starving. Uh, no. Ow. Why are you starving already? Give me that back. Oh, poison. Wait. Am I not getting my spells back for some reason? Do I have to have the holy symbol active to get my spells back? With the carry here, I like to pray for spells. No, not that. Best part. I bet you I have to have the holy symbol equipped. Uh huh. That makes sense. What does it do? Does it just give everybody a little bit of food? 
Oh! Yeah, we're fine. <laughs> it gives everybody a lot of food. Alright, Sanral. Uh, sorry about the spell book being gone. We didn't find it. Your entire life's work down the drain. But... If we ever find it, uh, good thing he has these memorized. Holy shit. Blur. Improved identify. <gasps> Milf's acid arrow. Ooh, detect magic. Hockey grab. God, if we can find him a spell book. He is gonna be set and a valuable member of team. Even if he's a goddamn filthy, disgusting, mushroom and moss sucking cave elf. It's only one thing worse than an elf. Fucking moss sucking cave elf. Oh, hi! Like, he's offering to help, and we need a sixth party member. He can come for no. That, all, that does make me wish that I would have uh, gone back to the first game before I started on this and dumped some good items for my other two characters into the other four's inventory. Like their spell book. Yeah. Rude. This is very appropriate music for the funny clerical carnival. Welcome to the Temple of Fun! <laughs> Please stay away from me. I was not expecting create food and water to fill up your food bar entirely. Like, maybe like a fourth or a full for one character. Like, that way you have to prepare a bunch of them if you really want to read the rewards. And the benefits of the thing. Yes, two pixels. Two pixels. <gasps> Three pixels! Hey. Eh? Lucky. Pass it here. Good thing we worship the same god. But we do! We're both dwarves! Yay. Hey, John, you want to hear the most annoying sound in this game? Ah! Uh... It burns! AIDS dwarf. <laughs> How do I get the display of a uh, Legend of Dark Moon cover art? The one down there? Yeah, it's freaking awesome. I love that, like, classical style. Oh, I have caused serious wounds. That's not what I wanted, but I'll take it. I have another one. Um, that's for Eye of the Beholder 3. Just the four fucking skeletons. Or five. Like, having uh, the, art, the cover art of all of them would be freaking cool. It's like classic 80s, like, pulp fantasy D&D &D art. 
before 5th edition came and it all just became generic digital art style stuff. Like, it's too clean and common. Like, it's very good art, but it's too generically styled uh, for my taste. Like, D&D always had a certain, like, not painting quality, but, like, it, it had its own art style. And then 5th edition now is just like, eh, it's good, but, like, it's... I've seen it in plenty of other places. Where is the soul? Where is your style? Where is your beard? You disgust me. All right. Damn it. Ah. Thought you were supposed to be our rogue. Oh, go scroll and create food. That's nice. Can you use those as not a cleric? Like, if you have a cleric, I'll have to do that. Got to be a hidden something over here. I don't have another key for this. I know there's another silver key door somewhere. I just have to go find it with my stupid little reset map. He had the classic guy paints on the side of his van fantasy style. Yeah, just like the developers learned how to how to draw. And then in, in like first and second edition. And then second edition they hired like amateur artists to kind of do it too. Uh, and then that kind of translated into the more official art of third edition. But they kept that kind of look to it. But touched it up a bit to be more professional. With, you know, actual lighting and details. That wasn't googly-eyed Durgan thing. And then 4th and 5th edition happened, and it's too smooth. I don't know. I don't like it! Harumph! Door still closed. <gasps> it is. I need. Do I link powers? What? Okay, so my map might have been cleared, but somewhere around here, I'm pretty sure there was a locked door that that key will go to. Do you have link powers to go hit cat yap? I mean, if you want to, nothing's like stopping anybody from doing that. map that I lost. I mean, technically, maybe, but, like, in the sense that you don't have time-time powers, but you're the size of a child, but you're also an adult. Therefore, you're technically both adult and kid Link at the same time? 
Catch me alive, Kappa. Oh, yeah, it was down here. In the actual, like, prison prison. Now we know. But first, I, I want to fill out the rest of the map. Didn't realize, because how could I? Ha! <laughs> the mini map. Or the auto map program. That's just fan made. Like, that doesn't come with a normal game. Oh, hi. Has the beds. It'd be cute if you rested on those tiles, you got a, uh, like, a small bonus for healing. Perhaps that is why. They all should. Okay, in here is fucking nothing. And then down here... Is more prisons. But sacred prisons, because this wasn't open before. There was a secret button. And then there's the keyhole! God damn it. Maybe it doesn't fit that lock. Oh, that's a skull key! I'm stupid. That one goes in the door. I found it right next to. Look, it doesn't look very scully, okay? Could have done this so long ago. And let me guess, in here I'm just going to find that other key, aren't I? Oh my god, what just happened? I got paralyzed. Two of them. I think I have cure paralysis. This is my new spell. It's called Eat Shit. Must be a. a it's a fucking touch spell. Eh. Back like. Cool. Yeah. I, I, I don't know if that did anything. It's ooh, dark moon key. <gasps> I told you it was just gonna be called like the dark key, but it's also called the moon key. Do you know? Mmm. 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 Hell yeah! I found his other holy symbol. Hopefully we can find the uh, elf skeleton's book. Oh shit, AoE protect from evil. I'm gonna do that one. I like one of that one. Holy symboli. Yeah, now we have more healing for the sleepy times. And that cause. I'm gonna take an extra bless with that. Oh, I could detect magic as a cleric. Yes. Yes, I do. I'm going to be the buffer, and I'm going to let Shorn deal with the, the, the lion share of the healing. Sanral with his one scroll. Wait a minute! Spellbook! Hey! Perfect! Yeah, this is probably uh, both their equipment, huh? Iron ration. Helmet for the boy. You can be not naked anymore. 
A basic longsword? God. I can't, Im I mean, I can't imagine. This game would be a lot harder thus far if I didn't have all the, like, plate mail and plus four and plus five longsword. Oh, look, more plate mail. It's probably not as good as plus three banded, though. Oh, it's as good as plus three banded. All right, I'm going to be greedy, and I'm going to take the shiny. Which means I should probably be in the back. And then our squishies we can protect up front. Nobody's left-handed on this team. Vile blasphemy that that is. Continue. Uh. Yeah, because, like, I have an armor class. Shorn has an armor class. Guess who don't? Wait, no. So if we get attacked from behind, uh... God damn it. No! Fuck you, mouse! My fancy new mouse that has not the broken keys that are gonna... We have a female adventurer bound in chains. She looks like she has been tortured. She's obviously frightened. The compassion you release her. Are you Amber? As soon as the shackles drop from her wrist, she whispers, Beware of these halls! I was captured by the evil clerics of this temple. What plans they had for me, I do not know, but the last night I saw what seemed to be a thousand death servants walking these halls. Please take me with you. Don't leave me here to die. I'm sorry. I don't suppose you're a wizard? When was the last time I saved shit? Ah, fuck. I want the wizard, though. I hope she wasn't a wizard. I would replace the drow with her. Uh, fuck. Wasn't Kalinora someone that was being looked for? Calandra, class fighter. Okay, no, we don't want her. But apparently Amber is a wizard, and we find her alive, which I figured we would. Yeah, she was the one that uh, the one adventuring lady was looking for, wasn't she? Hmm, head crushing machine. Let us not sleep in the room with the head crusher, huh? Now that we have the spell book and everything, he might actually have them prepared already. No, because he needs a spell book to prepare. And now, oh, look at all the healing. We have slightly more, because I didn't put, put much. I had like some like three extra cure light wounds. <laughs> Oh, look at all the healing. Oh, beautiful. Glorious Healies. I might actually replace Shorn with another mage. Because, like, I can handle the healing. Or at least the uh, throwing food around when it is it, 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 we, we rest a bunch. But he's a glorious dwarf friend, damn it. But having two wizards sounds fucking sexy. Dark moon. Oh, we have another skull key too now. Is there a new skull lock somewhere? Yes. <gasps> Scalamins! Kill! 
And another one that has its gross, disgusting skin on still. Oh, look at that fire. Bird undead. Burning hands. Skeletons are weak to fire, right? Like zombies. Burn their bones off. No. I really wish it didn't lag when enemies attacked. It's really hard to navigate these. Quick, improve, identify them. Yes. Darn. <laughs> Do you think they just synthesized a rubber band for that? Like we need a, we need a, we, I don't have a rubber band here, but we need a bow sound. Just put it between two fingers and thump. I guarantee you that's just a rubber band that they held in front of a microphone. Got that. Oh, look at that magic missile. Particle effects. I'm pretty sure it didn't even hit him. Oh, hey. I found your clothes so you're not wandering around naked. Dagger. Another skull key. I think that the, you get both the skull keys in here because you could have, I could have very well accidentally come over here when I'm supposed to use the skull key at the last room and used it in here and then completely soft lock myself out of the game if there wasn't. Try to force the door but fail. Oh, me strong. Okay, real quick. Um, I have no idea what that does. It probably identifies the item in his opposite hand. Oops. Oh! Oh, that's a lot of skeletons! Oh, fuck! They're everywhere! Oh, fuck skeletons and other type hits. Right? There's so many skeletons! It might help if I remembered to buff. I can protect from evil, and guess what skeletons are? That's right! We racist in this channel! Skeletons are objectively and never not unequivocally owl, 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 my dwarf. Who'd have thought? There's stings made of bones behind the bone door. No, not you. Not you! Kill them. Pump that man full of Heelys. All the Heelys in the world. It's not the same as the Daggerfall skeletons. This is the best skeleton sound effect. Lightning bolt! Get fucked. He didn't miss, did he? Rock and stone, he didn't miss, did he? Rock and stone! I can't read that! There's too many colors! Help! ADHD! Ah. God, I love my pocket healer dwarf. We're never getting rid of him. I've changed my mind. We're not replacing him with the second wizard. He is perfect against Skelemans. Oh shit, it worked! Yeah, show me that ass. Do the thug shaker. Shake that ass. No, go away. Yay! Oh, that, I can't... It didn't work on the last ones, and I tried it like 15 times. And by 15, I mean like 5. It's still a lot of skeleton turning. Oh shit, skeletons with skin! <laughs> Keep forgetting 
I have a rogue with a bow. Yes. Fuck you. Lightning bolt! I think lightning bolt wasn't working on the skeletons because they're like, they're, they are skeletons and it just went through their bones. Oh god. Ah! Never mind. Never mind. I was going to say, God bless this wizard. Never mind. <laughs> they have accurately coded the 20 foot radius of Ice Storm. Goodbye. Ow. Ow. You Scrooge, thank you for the follow. Welcome, skeletons. Oh, hi. Look, we can't be seen together anymore. You know how it is. There's far too many skeletons. <sighs> that was a lot of damage, but also that was a lot of damage that also hit me, and ouch. I'm gonna go back to the resurrection shrine. Thankfully... We have at least four more, I think. Excellent. Holy shit. There are so many skeletons, and now they're free to roam the dungeon as they please. Getting things all calcium. My party is starving. Any? How? Really? so much. Wait, were you so hungry? Was this not full food? Kegor, why are you so very hungry? Kegor has tapeworms. This is what you get for eating the dirt in the mines. When a party member dies, they get hungry after a res. Oh! Okay. They're resurrected without the food in their stomach. Or the nutrients. In their body. I just thought he was eating dirt and got tapeworms again. Like, I told him not to, but he says, No, this is the rock and stone way! Arr, arr, arr. Sometimes you find nature's noodle inside of it. Which is his word for worms. Which is kind of gross. Skeletons humping in the walls. Big oh. kill it, vile creature. Oh, oh! Another one. That genuinely scared me. I tried to move forward, but it didn't. And then, boom! Skeleton. Noted, Ice Storm is a distance spell. It actually has the frickin' 40 foot or 20 foot AOE coded. Skeletons aren't so bad when there's not hordes and hordes of skeletons. Oh, he's gone. They're hiding around the corners now. Trying to be sneaky. And they are rather sneaky. They're very light-footed when they don't have, like, 150 pounds of flesh and muscle. 
Although the clankety xylophone sounds of their little skeleton feet don't really help. It's like a trade-off, like one for one. Burning hands. Did that hit all of them? Are they, like, immune to fire? Because I'm not seeing them do the damage flash when I touch them. kids, right click. Did I lose an arrow somewhere? I thought I had 13. Possibly in the skeleton room? Eh, in the skeleton room. God, yeah, good thing I checked around the corners, because, like, that's definitely there to bait you into going forward to look at it. And then the skeletons, they come from behind. Which is my line as a dwarf. Neutralize poison. Is there poisonous skeletons? We Diablo now. Oh, boys. Oh, my God. There's so many more skeletons in there. There's just like eight more skeletons packed in that corner. There's this group and there's a group behind this group. Lightning bolt. This works, right? Yeah! See? One of them died. Be done. Yes. Ah. Oh. Glorious. Whatever that spell is called. It does frost and bludgeoning damage, which is very good against skeleton. But the frost isn't good against skeleton. The bludgeoning. You got any more? Peg, identify him. That is a skeleton. <gasps> Whoa. Problem. Uh, I am... I am trapped in this room. If I need to retreat, I can't. I love skeletons. He looks so fucking cool. He's got horns on his hat. That's the skeleton of a different animal. Establishing skeletal dominance. <laughs> Get fucked. Can I like just turn the skeleton only? Here he goes! Goodbye! <laughs> Looked at the Grimlock mod, and sadly it has been updated since 2014. That's fine, uh, because the 2014 version's very good still. It might not be updated because it's just, like, feature complete. Like, there's not much more to do other than slam random generation stuff down its throat, and then all the items and things. It's probably not as good as it could get, but it's still very functional from what I played. What? Oh. Clicked slightly too hard. We need a Grimrock 3? God, we do. 
or more games that are in that vein, classical style. Where did the skeletons run off to? You hiding over here? Or do they saunter back in and mitch my blade? There was another game that was really good in, like, that same grid-based style. Incredibly fucking jank, and I hope the developer didn't, uh, give up on it. Because, like, it got very, very rare updates. Meow. Oh, fuck. We out. So many skeletons. You ever play Crypt Master? No. Uh, but I watched someone else play it, which, you know, kind of ruins the entire thing for playing it through it now. Because it's not randomly generated or anything. It looked neat. Uh, not really the kind of game that I'd pay, like, whatever the price tag for it is. And the narrator just yell at me for typing butt too much. Fucking humorless boner. Jesus Christ, these ones hurt. Are these like a boss skeletons? Oh my god! <laughs> Your other friends weren't weren't this mean. rest here, or are they too close? Okay, we're good. I guess I'll plan to play in the Space Marine too. No, uh, I don't have the money for it. It is $60 dues, and I have $100 dues in my account, and, uh, that's too much for my bud. Oh my god, more skeletons! He's isolated the one. And now he's done. Haha, -ha. <laughs> I should be a bard. Haha! <laughs> Casually in the middle of combat. Floating food stuffs itself in your mouth. That's the Skyrim way, though. It's like, behold, I conjure cheese wheel! And it just immediately shoves itself down your throat and you heal like 20 HP. It's very uncomfortable. And does distract you for a round and gives enemies attack of opportunity, but. Cheese. Come back here. Not that. Quit. These skeletons are surprisingly fast. Neutralized poison. That concerns me. Because, like, I get giving me a neutralized poison scroll in the room with the spiders that poison you. These are not poisonous skeletons, because this is not Diablos. Ooh, I actually don't need food anymore. But, like, ooh, food. Oh. Okay, are all the skeletons dead? Just making sure. This is a big room of skeletons. Hot oh, damn. You got any secrets? Boner secrets? From the bones. Can I roll the bones and like... Do you think skeletons do that? 
Let me roll the bones! And he just pops off his hand. Chucks across the way. Here you go, hat. Short sword sting. That's a good reference. Leather booties. <gasps> or shorn. Axe the bait. But what's it do? What do you mean the bait? Does it be cursed and makes things jack off on me? No, not that, not that. Okay, how does identify work in this game? Quick! To uh the manual. Identify. Who would identify? When the spell is cast, one item in the wizard's hand. There we go. I was right. It has to be in his other hand. Is there, like, a list of the items in this game? Maybe in the clue book? Like, what the fuck do? Sting. Casting. Resting. Resting. Sting, sting. Plus two axe called the bait. A plus two short sword called sting. Normal boots, helmet, two iron rations. Serious wound spell, two cleric scrolls. Okay, so they're plus two. They are also pre-identified. That's why I... I'm supposed to, like, say plus two if I do this? Oh, do. I do this. So let's say plus two sting. Oh, it does! Okay. Oops. <laughs> Look, Acid Arrow only hits one thing, if I recall correctly, so... Much more lucrative to just have him be on that. John. John. John, are you sure? Fucking crippled bastard just gifts me a 60 buck game. Not crippled, retarded, like me. Win the brain. Uh, one sec. That's a lot of money, man. We kill bugs together? Good. Okay, we kill bugs together? Good. Do you want to kill bugs together on stream? Or... Because I have had people asking me if I, I'm going to stream this. We could, you know, gingerly touch our tips of our, our bolters as we go frolicking gently, holding hands, uh, crushing Xeno filth between our boots. And I go through the funny door. You fucking magnificent bastard. In this game, like 70 gigabytes. I'll have to make room. I have four terabytes of hard drive space dedicated to fucking, um, video games, and I can't fit 70 gigabytes. Yes. Uh... Oh, that's the button on the door. I'm like, there's a button on the minimap. Yes. There is. Let's do X the bait. Hey, plus one rib. This was the dagger you started, or not started with, but that I found. Plus two dagger, nice. Uh, I don't think you're ever gonna use those, but. Oh God, I should try to identify some other stuff. I wonder what the magic dust does. I think you sprinkle on skeletons and they go <laughs> as it leeches the calcium from their bones. There are some other things that I could identify too. Might as well do that, and then whenever we get something that's not identified, 
Oh, I know what I can do. Um. <gasps> the spell book is magic. Wow. Wow, your bow isn't magic. Have I not found a magic ranged weapon in this fucking game yet? <laughs> Ever? Magic powder's magic. Well, I know the horn's magic. You wanna try it? I wonder if I can, like, toot it. Okay, so nothing else. Actually, this is magic. Probably get back plus two. Yeah, plus one. I don't think there's any reason to hang on to these. Because there's no shops or anything in the game. Oh, neat. The helmet is magic. That's a helmet we'd have since the first game, I think. Oh, it's plus one. Nice. Oh, wait, is that Shorn's helmet? Oh, no, never mind. That's the one we found from uh, Shorn's thrown around gear pile, I think. Yeah, sweet. Uh, another AC for dude, right? No. <laughs> I am assuming they're both armor class. No? They have a ring of deflection? Yeah, ring of protection. One. One. Is the plus one helmet not actually plus one? Oh, Shorn Shield is magic. Good wizard. Look, he might be a probably... Oh, he's chaotic neutral. I was gonna say, he might be an evil drow, but we also, like, brought him back from the dead after millennia. Like, he's, he's, he's grateful. He owes us the blood oath. Okay, the shield bonus counts. Because he was at negative two before. Yeah, the, the plus one helmet doesn't do anything. 17, 11, 15, 15, 19, 9. 17, 11, 15, 15, 19, 9. 9 armor class, 9 armor class. That... Game developers! From like, the literal 80s or early 90s, your shit's broke! <laughs> yeah, the plus one... It's not even that the plus one helmet is like an armor bonus, therefore it doesn't stack with the plate mail, or a deflection bonus, therefore it doesn't stack with the ring of protection. It just doesn't do anything. Lame. Oh well. Also, Durham, why are you so behind on XP? Like, other people are level 8, 9, and 8, and 9, and 8, and 8, and 8, and 9, and you're just over here like, rocking it at 7. Look, he's having a great time. He doesn't need to be level 8. He doesn't need to justify his level. Maybe it's a three-person cost game, so if we wish to find another friend to play with us, we can get a gingerly touch our changes. I thought it was only two-person co-op. I don't think I know anybody who... Has it? At least among the, the streaming friend group of people I stream with. I'm sure if I ask around, like some random person in my World of Warcraft guild that's like, I got it! keys do I have? I have a skull key. I'm pretty sure that's a duplicate just to make sure that I don't softlock myself before I can get the moon key. Unless if you get both of them, there's... Oh, shit. That's multi-use. 
Unless if you get both of them, there's like a door behind this. That's a skull door. Like free loot. It's two uses. Two uses of uses. Dramona dizziness of vision of Kelvin appears in your mind. From the coin! My friends, I see you are within Dark Moon. What have you discovered? We've been in within Dark Moon for a long time. A skeleton cult kidnapping people, possibly turning them into skeletons. You explain to Kelvin that apparently Peaceful Temple is a stronghold of evil. You recount your tales of your battles with the clerics, Guerra. <laughs> this says guards. And numerous undead warriors. It so knows as if they are missing, massing an army. It is as I feared. You must continue with your quest and I'll learn more. I consult with the... God, that throws me off so much that the Ds look like O's. Like, I lose my train of thought and focus trying to read. Lords of Waterdeep, I will contact you again when I am able. Thanks! That's a lot of blood all of a sudden. Uh... Oh, damn! That's a lot of blood adventurers. Uh, good luck! Thanks, asshole. The fragment of parchment is burnt and bloodstained. Dran. As well as you have come to expect from my superior, if not Guli, intellect, I have exposed another one. Meet me at the northern intersection so that we may both. The rest of the message is burned away. I'm assuming northern intersection is going to be... Does this toot? Ooh! I'm assuming that if there's a northern intersection, um, there's a sneak grit, maybe. Okay, John, we're gonna stream uh, Space Marine tomorrow at the proper stream time. Perhaps earlier, if you are around. I have one demand, though. I get to play Captain Titties. Purely so I can make that joke far too many times. Potion of Speed, Skull Key, Healing. Vitality probably increases... Constitution. Or maybe it's a better healing potion. It might be a better healing potion. I remember there being better healing potions in the last game. Are you using the Waz control scene for this game like Dungeon Hack? Yep. I know nothing about Warhammer, but I like the games. Do I need to autistically explain to you the lore of Warhammer 40k for, like, two hours straight? Am I finally going to have this experience with somebody going, I don't know about who? <gasps> hey! 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 Smash? Is going nowhere? Let's try another wall. What if... Blunt weapon. Oh, right. Wait, if. Damn it. It's neat that it hints that, though. I will refund the game for both of us. <laughs> okay, I will. I don't even know if I could autistically explain Warhammer 40k. Like, I'd know the lore and be able to, like, talk about and reference stuff if it was put, like, on the spotlight in front of me. But, like, I have no idea where to start other than, uh, big gay beef man imps comes along and, oh, dear God! Uh, it gives humanity his gory glorious golden goo, and then we go to the stars. Shit's fantastic for, like, a thousand... 5,000 years, and then the robots rebel, uh, nuke everybody back to, like, bad times, and then ever since there has been bad times. And then, uh, Reconquista happened, and then, uh, his son said, fuck you, dad. And then several of his son other sons said, yeah, fuck you, dad. And then bad times became worse times, but this time with demons. Ow. not telling me let's try another wall god damn it can i shove something in the fireball hole
The whore ass heresy. <laughs> exactly. You like uh, gratuitously over the toply edgy shit, John. You would love Warhammer 40k's lore. Do I need a blunt weapon? It's not doing anything. Oh! Can I toot the horn and then the vibrations will go like that weird machine or sound coming out of my mom's bedroom when I was little? Machine? What the fuck is wrong with me? Ow! Toot 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 toot. I don't know, my tootin's not working. I assume you're supposed to break these in so you don't have to fuck with the fireballs. But it's not working. Oh, I haven't been in this room yet. The tunes! Why don't we read all the parchments again? <gasps> East Wino. Is it still toot? Oh. And then this one is. Ooh. I think I found the passageway to the hidden level. I am excited, if only. Level zero. Some type of entry ripped out of a journal. The architecture of these catacombs is marvelous and intriguing. I know about the drow and their fascination with hidden and secret passage. I must fino. You're a drow, Sanral. What do you say about hidden and passages and stuff? Sanral would probably say, hey, pretty cool. I like him. Good input, buddy. I do like the aesthetic. It's very grim, dark future of humanity is fucked, yada yada. Everything is fucked except for like vaguely the Tau. Although the Tau are also a shitty, brutal caste system that's run by assholes, but like they have living standards. Like that's a thing, I guess. You know, until like 500 years passes and all of their AI rebels and then uh, sends them back to the. Not Stone Age, but like the. the just into space. The Space Stone Age. I want to break out of the walls. Like, I know there's a way you're going to be able to do it to some of these, but, but what? Ugh! Wall looks exceptionally frail. Oh my god, it's graphical! And there's a rocket stone. Toot, 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 toot. Okay, is there literally nothing except for. I have to go find the other frail wall. The frailest of the frails. And all the other ones are just useless to try and try. Boo. The writing says there's no turning back. All here who enter are doomed. No, no, sorry, it says oomed. Or umio. Mines of extreme erosion. Toot at it! Stick a finger in it. I'm assuming, yes, there is a no coming back. Once I go through that door. Do I have everything I want? I don't think so, because there's still that entire upper level that has... Is there a skull key door there? 
There might have been. I'm going to go check that real quick. Maybe that's what I need this final skull key for. And save here in case there's absolutely nothing up there and I just want to reload back down here. Warhammer 40k is cool and all, but I like Warhammer Fantasy. I'm one of those assholes. It's got goblins, which so, so does the space version. Shut up. And there's something over here. Yeah, there was like a silver door. Which is what this little area over here is. That was isolated. Toot toot! Oh my god, it worked! Holy shit! A skeleton! A free skull for John! See? We've made up with your skull collection. Is that it? Neutralized poison? A sweet skull and... Lightning bolt? Yeah, the lightning bolt might be nice if I need an extra one. Copper key. Is this a skull key? No, it's another copper key. Unless. Unless. Yeah, I think doors that are story relevant you can't pick. But any door that's just, you know, hidden loot and stuff. Like that last door. Which I thought I tried to pick it before. Oh, hi! Mistake! Back to him! He's got our sacred trumpet! How dare you play our sacred trumpet! Just frolicking gingerly through the halls, insulting them, getting all of my mouth juices all over their sacred instrument. Hopefully there is a, a return, and I didn't simply miss one of those keys somewhere. I don't, like, have one on a dude, right? That I'm entirely forgetting about. Yeah? Well, if there is anything up there, oh well. Yeah, I don't think there's anywhere that I missed, unless it's behind a sneaker door somewhere. That appears to be a pressure pad. Right there, just in case. Save one. Save two. Scream and cry. Oh no! This door is scary! No one is able to get the door open. Oh. That was a scary noise. Hopefully that was uh, the music and not the game.
I have the feeling we have found ourselves within a maze. Did that just... Oh. Oh, no. That turns you. When you step there. It doesn't teleport you to, like, face a certain direction. It just turns you to the right. Or the left, or whatever it was. Oh, fuck me! Hi, gelatinous cube! Uh... Oh. Oh, not bad. You only have, like, 20 HP. Mm-hmm. This place is all topsy-turvy. Probably be, uh, cautious of those. I bet you, in lieu of them absorbing you, they probably just paralyze. Yeah, that shuffling noise, I think it's... But... Really? Hey, these guys suck. Yup. Hey, Doran finally leveled up. This is why I have this. Now, which one of these walls do you think has a switch on it? Be a great place for a random single button on one of these dozen walls. Like an asshole would the place. And it just like opens treasure in the center or something. I haven't seen a button that's not like down here, so... If I'm missing one that's in a different spot all of a sudden, let me know. This is very good, like, undercarriage crypt exploring music. Music reminds me of classic EverQuest. This isn't actually the game music. This is uh, the RuneScape soundtrack. Because the real game sounds like this. It's got big spouse that won't fucking go to sleep energy. There we go. What'd that do? I just turn off the spinny? Shh, shh, shh. Yeah, that just turns off the spinners. Does that... Is there another one? Does that do anything for me other than cease annoyance? Beep. Hmm. Wait, it doesn't like open one of these. Oh my god! Shh, shh. Aggressive rain sticks.
possess brooms around every corner. Oh god. The silence is magnifique. Ten out of ten. How did it how did best game? Best game. Ten. Miss the music. It's the only thing that's keeping me distracted from the fact that I had to pee, but I only have 30 minutes left, so I don't want to get up to pee. Roar. Um, 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 um. I love him. Really? Nothing? Yeah, you cheeky goose. Those doors kind of look deadly. Like you'd walk in here and then it'd close and crush you between the teeps. What is that? It's a gurgle! Ow. Not that. That or it's a vampiric creature. I think they're gargoyles. Unless... Eh? Still have that bone key from before. Oh, hi. I wish you could click the enemies to see what they were. Aw, oh, dang it, I was gonna say, I have a Dark Moon Key! No, I don't. It was good for two uses. Fuck! Now yeah, my knee. New idea for a dungeon for my players, every single door is a mimic. Let me know at one point which they go, surely another door isn't a mimic, right? And then he, no. The spoiler key. Spiders. Oh shit, do you think? Hold on, there's a reason you are a rogue. One of these might be like loot, and we can just. Surely this keg of ale can't be a mimic. I was desperate and thirsty. And you, sir, are an asshole for making the giant keg of ale a mimic. <sighs> Abusing my dwarfly intuition. Sounds kind of racist. Oh, hi! Stereotype in my ass. <laughs> hmm, this room is suspiciously empty. I haven't even been trying to find illusory walls. Is there nothing in here? <laughs> Might be like a resting room, but I don't know if you can get attacked. Fake! <laughs> what are they? It's a Margoyle! Yeah, the uh, the combat, like, interface bonus program thing tells me the names. Are you also a Margoyle? Yes. He has 34 HP. And now he has zero. Wait. Hey. Nah. They locked me in! Assholes. One of these is going to be a secret door. Oh, hi. Come back, I need that.
fire the game developers. I would have just made bows have unlimited ammo. Or, fuck, just like, when you walk over the ammo, it picks it back up. It's really annoying having to go grab it all in my grabby hands. Where the fuck do I go from here? Oh, hi. Did I pick up a key? I have... This one. Certainly doesn't look like it fits any of these locks. Hold up. I'm not intuiting enough. Oh, that's it's that's what's off my monitor. Rogue. Yeah, so it's not showing me going over here on the map because it's off screen for uh, my actual fucking monitor. Where the shit? Maybe one of these is an invisible wall. And that's the hint. Four doors, but only two locks. Can imply one of these or two of these are opened another way. But a hounced. is an illusory wall somewhere. I'm just give one of my druids my current campaign the coin of Jison the Bountiful. What a horrible, cursed, crazy thing is that? I am in no position to open links right now. This just screams, look around for hidden secrets. Yeah, fuck. And I already looked uh, on all the walls in the center area here, yeah? If I can click something. Oh, hi. Now that the Heather Pratters are off. Uh, the owner of the coin gradually grows more skillful. Especially in the regard of mercantile regard. Okay, what are the mechanics, though? You have the ability to cast suggestion, plant growth, and occasionally control weather. Is that, like, actually what the item does? Greedy use has resulted in a curse being placed on its owner. Increases the victim's hunger proportional to their greed. Person who had abused the coin 
amass great personal wealth and power will find themselves trying to devour extreme quantities of food, tea, and coffee. Specifically those, it doesn't turn you into a drunk. I'm gonna give you a heart attack from caffeine overdose, though. Get the coin to a stranger is the only way to get rid of the curse. Okay, but what, like, mechanically does it do in the video game? I assume you cast those spells, but if you do it far too many times without, like, letting somebody else have a crack at it, you get hungry. The fuck? Let me out! Turns out that this is entirely a trick area. And if you go in here, there is literally no getting out. Ouch. I find it weird it specifically mentions tea and coffee, not just food and drink. Specifically. Calfia and Guintia. Where the fuck do I go in here? Grant's suggestion in plant growth. Okay. Oh, is that just what it does, like, mechanically? You just can cast those spells? Once per day. Cute. Control weather is a uh, really nice thing to be able to cast at that much of a whim, though. Did I find the key and I just fucking brained it? No? works occasionally, as per the description. Sometimes might not work right. I was gonna say, if you're, like, fighting anything that has flight, immediately summoning a thunderstorm. Slightly niche, but, like, goddamn. You can also use it to make people fucking love you. It's like, hey, you want ra rain for your crop growth? Yoink! Which actually is probably what the uh, coin intends. Like, you don't necessarily have to let somebody else use it, but you can use it for other people to bring, like, prosperity wherever you go. Like, hey, you have a slight drought in your village? Boom, rain. I'd say that would be a good item uh, limitation for that item, is you can only use uh, those in the aid of others. And maybe, like, once you've helped uh, a certain number of people, then you can use it for yourself after the first time. God damn it! I should have known! Duh. People coming for you for the love you means them trying to give you treasures and gold, hence the greedy curse. Oh, well, it depends on why you're doing it. Like, if you're just doing it to help and you're not expecting a reward, then yes. But yeah, if you're just doing it uh, to get people to love you and uh, for uh, vain reasons and stuff effectively. Yeah. Can't believe I never tried to... Oh, hi! Vengeance of death and destruction plague your sleep! You're only able to rest here! Wait, really? That's cool. Look at that skeleton. I need a screenshot of that skeleton. He's going in the thumbnail. Ooh, fit board. No, wait. Two file. I am tired. I haven't eaten in hours. Uh. Pictures. Save. I am unable to rest here. Great! Fuck. Okay. Uh.
fart.reverb. What do you mean, miss? Iron strength. Hopefully the potions of vitality actually heal. Oh, those are improved healing. Nice. Do I have any more of those? <gasps> Extra healing. See, I thought I got better healies. And I did! <laughs> he rolled, rolled the shit out of that. Uh, let's find out what potions of vitality do. Feels satiated. Oh, it's a food potion. Eat. Vitality is not what I would have called that, but, you know. What's your health total? Like, he either has a lot of health or just completely bungled the healing roll. Completely bungled the healing roll. Okay, well, that fucking sucks. Um, Good thing I haven't been using spells willy-nilly. What happened to Shorn Shield? The gelatinous cubes can consume items, can't they? Hopefully that only applies to non-magical items. Else that would suck huge big throbbing dongs. That's a key. Okay, I guess technically anything can be a key if it goes into a slot. Another skull for the pile! Here you go, John. Sometimes shields can go there. Sometimes no. God, what spider key do Are we concerned about that? Probably. Oh, I got three different spider key doors I can open first, though. I don't like the look of this place. Save. 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 Oh, look! Another skull for the skull collection! Oh, God. I was right! <laughs> This place is fucking horse shit! Kill it! Oh, there's so many. Uh, go! Improved identify! These skeletons are immune to the shit that I was trying to hit them with. Oh, I need a lightning bolt! Like, these things are flashing when they get hit. Okay. Strategies achieved. Ow. Stop. No. Ow. That fucking hurt. Half cool. Nice. Uh, pain. That was incredibly bad. Shit. Okay, uh... 
a shield. I can identify those, but it'll be the only things I can identify because I can't rest. just a loot room. Unless there's more? Come on, secret door. Damn it. I don't think this is going to be a better longsword than my plus four and plus five one, but... Might as well see. Not you. Plus five bracers of protection? Jesus. Well, Thagor is, is going to not be having uh, difficulties... With AC anymore. Oh, you can only have one big item. I thought you could have no big items. Except for the times where it did go in there. Cannot release the weapon, it is cursed. Ah, fun. I don't have remove curse prepared, do I? Hmm. I was waiting for when that comes along. Uh, well, the other ones at least aren't cursed, right? Can I at least see what it does? Oh god, the bracers might be cursed too. Negative eight armor class. No, no. They are not cursed in the slightest. Jesus. Well, uh, well, you don't have to worry about Thagor taking uh, the lion's share of the damage anymore. His days of getting the crap beat out of him are over. To save those for if you like find a big ass room of shit. Like that last one. That'd have been nice to use. <laughs> shit. Oh well. It'll be fine. probably use the spider key on the closest door I found it to, but it also might expect you to use it on that door, and that's the door of progress, but if I run back and I use it on the other doors, it leads to more spider keys and also loot. Spider shield. Oh, spider keys, spider shield, spider shit. It's their fucking drow. They worship the fucking spider bitch, of course. And here I was going, oh, this is nice, like spiders. That's, that's cute, I guess. <laughs> Yay for putting two and two together finally after far too long. I'd smart. As a suspiciously placed pressure pad. And I'm assuming... Hi. Closes that front door behind me and summons a bunch of shit. Uh-oh. 
one of these where I have to go on all of them at once. Or, well, in a row, without stepping on the other ones. You must leave many things behind. Ah. That's what it is. John, I might have to use your skull collection. Or... Feels all the random crap that I'm never gonna use. I actually wanna use the prayer scroll coming up. Because we can't rest in here. Rude! Mr. Daw, I have indeed left many things behind. You lying sack of crap. Did I not? I got them all. It's not like the rocks don't count or the treasure plate wouldn't have gone down. Yeah, huh? Does it have to be not rocks? Those don't work despite Oh, hi. Despite the pressure plate actually going down. Mr. Dart, what the fuck? It's not like I'm trying to leave rocks and fucking, like, arrows or something. I'm trying to leave many things behind. And have. Yeah, and I don't have another spider key. God, does it like expect me to leave equipment proper? things that are relatively expendable. Helmets probably don't count either. Because they generally do nothing. Open up, fucker! Yeah, I'm gonna look that up. Because if the pressure pads didn't go down... That'd be one thing. Like, if it's gonna be fucking picky, 
Many things. Up the door. The south pressure plates must be weighed down. Oh, left behind. As in only the pressure plates that are behind you. That's fucking stupid and I love it. I am not smart enough for Dungeons and Dragons. I wonder if left behind, it's also the things to the left of me. It's not a check of, yeah, uh, dump your gear, dumbass. It's a smarty pants. Damn it. Well, he's going to be like that for a while. Oh, you must leave many things behind, not left behind, as in two directions. Eh? They're behind! All right, straight up cheating now. Uh, go back. You must leave many things behind to open the door of the south pressure plates. To open the door to the south. I'm stupid. Pressure plates 20 A, C, G, and I must be weighed down with an item. The party must step onto 20 E. And the door opens. Keep the door open, leave an item on pressure plate 20 evil. The party's still on it. Bug. Go away! Thank you. 
problem is, I don't know which one is like 20i, but it said 4, so. It's just this one. Maybe I have to... Leave them here, then, like, leave. As in, be on this side. Problem is, I don't know which one is, uh, like, A, B, C, D, I, or whatever the hell it is. Yeah. If it said, like, you know, the, the southern or eastern pressure plates... Look at just the entire map, but I guess I can. Uh, A, B, C, and I. Oh my god, it is left and behind. I was fucking right. The, the riddle doesn't work because you didn't say many things must be left behind. It says you may leave, just leave many things behind. It's behind and to the left. Right? A, C, G, and I must be weighed down. That's exactly what it is. It's left and behind. So to my left and behind. Oh, it's not open end. Friend must then step onto 20E and the door opens. 20E is the centered. Oh, ACG, not... What? That's not many items must be left behind, leave many items behind. That's... Four corners. What? That doesn't give any hint for which pressure pads you're supposed to have. If it's not like, leave many things behind makes sense if you have to pressure down the plates that are behind you. Or many things must be left behind would be left, the ones to the left and behind of you. This isn't that, this is just they're at a fucking crisscross pattern to your ass. This is just guess at that point. That's not a riddle. It'd be a riddle if it was like, oh, uh, X marks the spot or some shit. However you'd word that into a, a, a riddle for this. Or like, what do pirates search for? It's like, oh, well, treasure X marks the spot, yada yada. I would not be smart enough to get, oh, X marks the spot, xylophone must go. Looked on phonics. Piece of shit. Damn you, 80s moon logic. Problem, people are dying. These guys have gotten remarkably good at hitting all of a sudden. Is 
Same cannot be said for our archer. No, the tunes! Oh, this ain't looking good. I'm being nickel and dime to death. Where'd my 13th arrow go? Oh my god, fuck you! Where are you guys coming from? Leave the dying guy alone. And all of a sudden, can't hit shit. But they sure can. Fuck you! Oh, fuck you! We're dead. 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 Yep. Right. I'm 15 minutes over time because that stupid puzzle. I'm just gonna go. Goodbye. Yeah. I guess I do have Ray's person. I don't have any way to heal them though, and Ray's dead is only uh brings the fact with one HP most likely. So that's probably a bad idea. Yes, I would like to exit the game. Thank you. Thank you all very, very much for watching. Thank you, John, for the stuff and a Scrooge for the follow. I am going to send y'all over to our good friend, Toki. Who's currently playing Animal Crossing? In this day and age, having a good time. How dare he? Y'all have a lovely evening. Bye-bye.